Hi guys. Hold on a second. Let me turn this down a little. Hi guys. How are you? How are you? Hello. Hello, my people. Hello. I'm here. I'm here. How are you? How is everyone? How is everyone? I see Janice and love to cook. By the way, it's Delta 8 and it's Granddaddy Perk. I never named this. No, I have named it. I call this wig my River Sawn wig. Those who are in the know are in the know. Good evening. God bless. Hi, Trisha. Hi, Pixie Girl. Hi, guys. And thank you, Janice, for the compliment. So I'm going to partake in some Pepsi uh, Wild Cherry right now. And my lovely Lord of the Rings goblets, because we're all nerds here. But we don't like that modern nerd shit, okay? We like the classics. Every once in a while, modern society, like gives us a fucking gem like Cardi B or something like that. But most of everything that's out there now is just putrid and it sucks. Who fucking agrees with me? Cheers. 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 What's up, my lovers? What's up, my lovers? Have I ever tried Dab and Delta? No. How is it? Thank you, Curious Critter. Uh, critter. <laughs> Hi, KM. <laughs> Hi, Maniac Monday. How are you? Cheers. We're Pepsi bitches today. That's what we have to be. Now listen, to listen, the person I blocked in my comments over my last video. Let me just tell you, I happen to be an actress, an actress. And not only that, a comedian. And not only that, a voice actor. So please do not come to me, the talent, and tell me I can't sound like fucking Fran Drescher if I want to or not. I can put a voice on very hard if I want to. <laughs> I can do it, okay? I can do a bunch of voices. Oh, would you rather me, you know, sound like Granny, darling? I don't know. I don't know. But the people who know me here, the people who know me here know that I am a voice actor, darling. And a damn good one at that. Because you are also talking to the Goblin Queen. And you cannot talk to a queen like that. Uh, you get a job, troll bot. I'm doing what I can to help my family. What are you doing in life? Picking on people, being abusive to people. You're the scammer. 
You know why you're the scammer, darling? Because I am an entertainer, and entertainers need to be paid, darling. So sit there with your your bitter, bitter behind, and and go insert a cucumber up your brown hole. There, I said it. I said it. Damn right, I said it. Thank you, V. Sexton. I look like one of those 80 rockers. Hey, guys! Wow! Oh, wait. Like, don't they have, like, the Valley Girl sound, like, in the 80s? You know what I mean? Like, I mean, for real. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, darlings. I slept in after that 24 marathon. I slept in, and this is shocking for me because I'm usually up at 7 a.m. every day. I woke up. I went to sleep at 10 p.m., and I woke up at 1. Those 24 hours, it was more like 48 hours without sleep. I, I loved every bit of it. I thought it was wonderful. Thank you, wise guy. You are a splendid, splendid man, and I love you, and you will get all my naughty pictures when I finally open up my OnlyFans. But if you would like to donate me, that you would help further the advance of said OnlyFans, I have to get my license. It's $30.00. And, um, damn, he needs to go and switch his, uh, address, so that's another $30, so that would be a total of $60 that I need, so I can switch everything over, so I can have a OnlyFans, and, and then a Chatterbait, I think I shall do that as well, because that would be fun, because I really do like being a, you know, a cam girl. Speaking of which, I have a very special live stream coming up soon where I'm going to be calling a special place and, you know, oh, let me just spill the beans. It's basically me speed dating while married for the views. It's going to be funny. I'm going to be trolling men. Isn't that lovely? Trolling the men. <sighs> Where's my marvelous husband? Well, he's a tired, tired boy, and he's currently taking a nap after taking his medicine. Hello, darling BBW, Latina J Vlogs. How are you, my beautiful Colombian queen? <laughs> Well, wise guy. Mop, it doesn't sound stupid. It sounds brilliant. You, on the other hand, you're rude. Why are you so rude, Mop? Have you not been cleaned for a while, Mop? Do you need to be reined out, Mop? I think he does. Well, you know what? I'm not your mother. Do it yourself. I'm 38 years old, I'm a grown-ass woman, and you're a grown-ass man. Do what you need, Mop. <laughs> Mama in Christian says hi. Hi, rip my thing off. Ooh, you're here with me. I love you. Your face, Mop, this is brilliant. <laughs> Thank you, Theo. Rev is taking a nap this stream. Yeah, he's doing the Nadia. He's doing the Nadia Chambers act. He's like, oh, I'm sleeping. And everyone's like, where's Rev? I need you, baby. His butt is upon my hip. I swear to God right now. Oh, thank you, wise guy. <laughs> thank you, rip my thing off. 
pops to you, BBW. Thank you. It, it, it does really choke. And it jingles. Ooh, we can have a little ASMR. Hi, guys. How are you? It is me doing your ASMR act. I think all of you are beautiful people. And I just want to tell you how much I love you. Bongiorno. <clears throat> Long live the Queen, Elizabeth. <laughs> when did I get married? March 3rd of 2018. Or March 7th. I said March 3rd. Oh, my God. <laughs> March 7th. Oh, my God. I'm a naughty, naughty wife, ain't I? He knows how naughty I am. Tired individual, yes. He saw me and he passed out. He was like, God damn. <laughs> like a kitty cat, that's right. <laughs> and yes, Black Poodle, it's another look of mine. I have many looks, like many skills. I'm like Xena, the warrior princess. Oh, choppy. Your insults are amateur. But I'm trying not to judge people here. I'm trying to be kind. Please do not let me revert to my fleshly ways <coughs> oh mm. Theo <laughs> what's on the agenda today well I want let me let me tell you something rip my scene off let me tell you I want to finish that damn chrono trigger game because I'm a nerd and I want to finish Chrono Trigger because I haven't played it in like 20 fucking years. Maybe longer than that. Maybe longer than that. And I really want to know the storyline again because I'm nostalgic. And I think a lot of people have been nostalgic lately because everything fucking sucks here lately. Like the Matrix, or Biden, or Kamala, or Trump, or those drama channels that pretend they're entertaining, but really throw in entertaining people in because they're untalented. They can't do it on their own, and they don't have the confidence to do it on their own. So, like, the people they are, they just go and decide to steal said beautiful content from talented individuals. Because it's a trick. And you don't realize the magic, but I just told you the trick, so magic undone. That's why the truth is very, um, what can I say in magic? That's why the truth is always hidden. Because if you knew the trick, the magic doesn't fucking work. Jesus bless. Uh, marijuana. 
free marijuana, says the BBW 420 Latina J vlogs. She smokes the dope. But you know what? She's living life to the highest. With the highest. And that is Yahweh. Amen, sister. You need Shani cooking videos in your life? I know. I need help and support so I can get said cooking utensils so I can make you bomb food. That's right, rip my thing off. The truth will set you free. You don't need tricks when you have the truth. How is Rev tonight? He's a tired boy. I tired him out. You know what I mean? Why is that so bloody freaking loud? Lord Jesus. Do I have it? Yeah, you do. I don't fuck. There it is. It's by my hip. Wow. Let me turn this down. Mm. There. Vile thing. <laughs> bomb food, right? I make bomb food, man. I think I misheard. Did you? I don't know. I don't know. You may have not have disheard. My God, Eugenia Cooney went live. All right, so, since she went live, can someone clip this one moment? I have to say something to her. Because she needs help. Because she's still in the mindset that super skinny is attractive. And no dear, no dear, no dear. Eugenia, listen, listen. It's supposed to be this way. Eugenia, darling, sweetheart, my love, listen, listen, Eugenia Cooney, you, you, darling, you, darling, men and women, they like meat on a woman, okay, this is no shade, But men like meat on a woman. The super skinny thing, it's out in fashion. And I know you enjoy fashion. Okay? You enjoy fashion. So if you want to be fashionable, I have some ideas to help you, okay? If you want to be fashionable, you got to get some meat on you so you can fill your clothes out. They can't be hanging off you like that. You have to fill it out, you know? I want to see a Eugenia Sexy Cooney with a big booty and titties, okay? I want to see that, Eugenia. I don't want to see a Eugenia that's real thin because she's not eating, okay? Everyone's noticing it. I'm noticing it. I'm, I'm going to be your mom here, okay? Because you're 25. I'm 38. You know, I used to work really hard at my body. And I destroyed it by working so hard on my body. And you're working really hard on your body, too. I can see it. But I'm telling you, honey, if you eat, if 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 you get some meat on you, like start mukbanging on YouTube. Everyone would watch you. You would probably be better than PewDiePie at that point if you started doing mukbangs on, on YouTube. Okay, Eugenia? Like, seriously. And get some titties and ass on you. Like, Amaranth. She's one of the biggest people right now on Twitch. She's absolutely breathtakingly gorgeous. She's like a Barbie doll. And she's got meat on her. Barbie dolls have meat on them. They got big thighs and big asses and big titties. That's in right now. Men want me. Women want me. It's tasty. It's like, ooh, let me eat that. Let me feel that. It's fun. Like, it's fun. It's fun to see the jiggle. You know what I mean? But, Eugenia, 
please learn as an older woman being voluptuous makes you feel so fucking sexy. You see everything in you and you're like, damn, I look fucking good. I am 38 years old. Most people think I'm 25. <laughs> I'm 38 and everyone thinks I'm 25. I was born in 83. I'm going to be 39 this year. 39. And I'm going to have a 13-year-old and a 15-year-old. How about that? You know? And you'll be healthier. You're not healthy. You're not at a healthy weight. And and, and it, it's it's like... How do I put it? When people look at you, what they're seeing is like someone who's starving. That's what you look like. You look like you're starving. And it's not a good look because everyone's afraid for you. Because people know what happens to starving people. And nobody wants to see that. So, Eugenia, embrace your womanhood. Women naturally are supposed to have curves. They're supposed to have meat on them. They're supposed to be juicy. <laughs> it's only been a hundred years where people thought that super thin women were attractive. It's only been a hundred years. Most women who are pitcher makes make, put in pictures and and put in sculptures. They all have curves. They all look. Like women, like real women, like just curvy, and, and and it was it was said that wealthy women, they 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 had to have meat on them, and in Africa, they know the woman has a lot of money because she's big. They know that you know she has a lot of money because of that. You know, this is something that we naturally have to accept within ourselves that bodies are beautiful no matter what sizes and i know you're afraid to eat i know you you're like i don't want to look like my mother i know you're probably like that you don't want to look like your mom <laughs> but it's okay if you do because you can be a mom to a 13 year old and a 15 year old and be really fucking sexy okay you can have meat on you and look damn good. So do it. Make yourself a mook baner. Show everyone your curves, girl. That's all I have to say to you. I love you, girl. You are my star. You're a sweet, beautiful girl. And I love you to death. And I don't want to see you die. I don't want to see you die because I love you so much. And I hope more people who are her fans genuinely come out and say this to her. Because she needs someone to tell her this instead of everyone kissing her ass. Real friends don't kiss ass. They tell you the truth. Okay? And I'm trying to be your friend here. I'm trying to be like your mom here. I'm trying to give you an older woman's advice. It's okay to have curves. It's okay to have meat. It's okay to look good. Okay? It's okay to look good and have meat on you. And don't worry. You can get a fine-ass man. Okay? I've had plenty of good-looking men. I've had a lot of good-looking men. And I, I never was... A size zero. I was always a size 12 and above. I've even been a 28 before and I still got gorgeous muscular men. And the reason that is, is most men 
know this is bigger women when when they're making love to them they know that they won't break you just think about that most men are afraid to break you I would feel like I would break you don't be broken get back whole you were so pretty when you had so much weight on you. You were so pretty. I love seeing your face fill out because you have such a gorgeous jawline that when your face was fuller, it just was so beautiful and you could see your beautiful cheekbones. Your arms were gorgeous. I didn't have to see like bones because bones aren't attractive. That just means death. I want to see you alive. You say you believe in Jesus. Well, come alive. Come alive. And, and eat. It's okay to eat. You can eat in abundance. And everyone will love you still. Trust me. And everyone will root you on. They will root you on doing mukbangs. Trust me. And you'll gain more subscribers than you've ever thought. And you'd get all the encouragement in the world. And you'd be happy and not miserable and your stomach wouldn't ache anymore. And every person likes to see a good mukbang. And you're talented enough to throw that off. Just listen to my advice. I know I'm right. I've been doing YouTube since the beginning. I'm very, very, very knowledgeable in what would get someone big. Those who can't do teach. So I'm teaching you. So. Do what you must do. Eugenia knows who I am. Shut up, cloppy slops. You pessimist. <laughs> I feel much better with a normal BMI. I like kind of being fluffy and voluptuous and, and, and with a booty and hips and, and big old boobies. I like it. Yes, baby bear farms. Dark hair, Shani. You guys wondered how I would look with dark hair. Well, surprise. I aim to please. I really do. <laughs> I drank that up fast, man. Hi, Jason Guacamole. How are you, darling? I'm all muscle. No meat, no bones. Ooh. Uh, do you work out a lot? Is that what it is, Ruby? Long time no see. Cheers, darling. I'm having a wild cherry Pepsi. What are you having to drink for today? <laughs> you look like foodie beauty back in the good old days, BB era. Yeah, but about... Never mind, I'm not going to say it. <laughs> Ew! It was a wiser brother. Ew. You weird old man. Mostly women watch this channel. Why are you watching a woman's channel? What's wrong with you? 
I don't care about your opinion. You're not welcome here. You do not insult the queen. I do martial arts and my girlfriend likes strong girl, so happy wife, happy life. Martial arts. I used to kick box. I love it. Shady Shanny, <laughs> we love to see it. Thank you. Water is all I drink. Well, I'm glad you can do that. I, for the other hand, cannot. I try, but I cannot. Are men not allowed? No, that man is not allowed. I'm just shading him. He knows why. He's a creep. <laughs> you kind of look like Howard Stern, yeah. It's the Howard Stern hair. Or the River Son hair. Thank you, baby bear. You cam. That's right. <laughs> I live on soda so much it's predictable practically my blood. Exactly. I know. Mm -mm. How how does water hydrate you? That's that's what I'm wondering. I mean you don't even get the a sweet taste down your throat and, 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 and carbonation. Like, don't you need, like, the carbonation to, like, make your innards go, woo! Like, where do you get from that? And, and, and your constant intake of caffeine, how do you get that? I would be having headaches for a month. Ew! Ew, another creeper man. Ew. Yuck. Ew. I drink soda like once a week. Tonight is that night. Getting wild tonight. Woo, savage. You party animal getting like, I'll drink you with the soda. No water hydrates. Maybe for you. I need a little something, something else. <laughs> oh my God. Caught. Oh, I've been caught. Now, darlings, listen, I am a comedian, so please take the things I say as jokes. Comedy, comedy. Comedy is dead when everyone finds what you say offensive. Comedy, in my personal opinion, because people are so goddamn miserable. Comedy, because I know the Hegelian dialect. Because I know how borderline personality disorder is like. And I'm aware of depression, but I'm also trained with my dialect behavior therapy to help you out and, and said suffering of, of finding everything so offensive. So, when you are in a shitty mood, please, just listen to me, okay? When you are in a shitty mood and you feel pessimistic toward others. <clears throat> you must watch something opposite 
of how you're feeling. And that feeling right there is comedy, to laugh, to joke, to, to find what is ironic in life and to laugh at it. Thank you, Theo. He knows me well. <laughs> He knows me so well. He'd seen my innards. You all have, admit it. Admit it. You've looked, you peeked. How dare you, naughty boys. Is the G-Man still there? No, he was there er here earlier, but he left. He had to go back home. He's working a lot. He he's he's so sweet. I made him giggle a few times. I said a little naughty bits and he giggled and it was cute. Anyway, comedy must come back. The, the offense of people must cease to exist. See, comedy sometimes is offensive. That's what you laugh at. You laugh at the offense. It makes you feel uncomfortable. It makes you like, how do I deal with this situation? This, this thing that offends me in my heart. You laugh at it because it's funny because it's opposite of what you think and it it um, it kind of gives you a cognitive dissonance so you laugh at it because it makes you feel uncomfortable. It, it's it's kind of like how when you watch a scary movie and you get real and you watch them to get really scared just to get like a relief. That is comedy. Sheer entertainment and 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 perfect in every way. Perfect in every way is comedy. Do you agree? I'm talking about comedy and you're talking about the transatlantic shit. What the fuck? My lord. I think she has many soft spots. <gasps> oh, Theo. You naughty boy. I indeed do have a lot of soft spots. In fact, mm, my husband is touching one right now. And guess what that is? <clears throat> now you had it, but now you lost it. Did I? Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> I do what I do. Love me or hate me, I am still me, no matter what. And that's what people truly despise. Is that you decide to be yourself regardless of all the bastards out there trying to tell you that you're doing something wrong. Well, fuck you, you know? You know, some things are a matter of perspective. Your perspective is this woman is being silly. My perspective is I'm being purposely silly, goddammit. So. Who's ready for some chrono cr trigger? Hello, Selen Mac. Hello, Simply Krista. Oh, Simply Krista! <laughs> the soft spot your husband touches you is your last nerve. Jesus! I'm so sorry that you have a husband like that. 
Hello, Jessica H. You know, there's sometimes he does that to me, too. But, you know, he, he recognizes really cr quickly that I have the wrath of God behind me. So he stops. No one wants the wrath of God. Or, uh, well, atheists do, because they just refuse to believe because they want to be cool and edgy toward God. Because, you know, they their goldfish died when they were, Santa, you know, seven, or they have Santa syndrome, or, or... Or, you know, they prayed for a pony and the pony didn't be delivered that exact time. <sighs> Eventually they got the pony and they're like, Ha! I got it myself when really it was God just preparing you to get a fucking pony. <laughs> mm -hmm. Have I tried golden eye? No, I've never have. But I can. Billy's beard, don't be rude. You tell him that curious critter. What, Santa Syndrome? Santa Syndrome. Okay. Santa Syndrome is when you become an atheist because they found out that Santa Claus isn't real. That is Santa Syndrome. It was created by a YouTuber called Shock of God, and he has evidence upon evidence that Shock of God has evidence upon evidence of Santa Syndrome and atheists becoming, you know, atheists because Santa doesn't exist. Or, the, or, you know, you can even say the Easter Bunny Syndrome, too, because they find that out, too. I know, love this sheet. That's so sad. Now they're going to go and profit off him while he's dead. Bastards. Gold and I have their own community. Oh, Terry. That sounds fun. I do a little Gold and I. <laughs> but I must do some Chrono Trigger. I have to finish it. It, 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 my mind. I'm like, are we going to get Chrono back on Death Peak or do I have to do another stupid fucking mission to get him back? I don't remember. And I'm not going to go on Game Facts. That's another series that I'm working on. I'm not going on Game Facts this game to discover that because I kind of, you know, it's been 20 years, so I'm kind of like naturally like just, you know, it's kind of new to me, you know what I mean, at the same time. But yeah, I remember some things, especially if you ever thought about doing speed runs. GoldenEye is amazing. I might think of that. I had wonderful holidays. I love this sheet. I kind of see that. They grow up not knowing the difference between know and believe. And when they realize they just believe in God, they go a little atheist for a minute. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. And we need to turn them away from said thought pattern. Because God is everywhere and you can test him and it works. I'm just saying answered prayer argument is true it is real i know it i've tested it I, and you know it is a scientific method if if you get the same result and it is repeatable it is true and i do you know why because i listen to jesus when he says have faith in me and i do and I try to walk his way the best I can because I love him. Oh my God, Mo, you know, Shani. You're so famous. Mo is famous? 
No. Mo Wiggles, are you someone famous on the internet and I have no clue? <sighs> Thank you, gingerbread kisses. Wow, is that the real Mo Wiggles? Who's Mo Wiggles? I gotta find Mo Wiggles. Mo Wiggles, I'm finding you. I made Jason poor, wet brained, sterile, and disgusting. Hey. What's <laughs> I made Jason a fucking man. Thank you very much. I have rocked that man's world. Thank you very much. Yeah. I didn't make him broke. Everything he gave me was gifts, baby. Gifts. Because he wanted the best for me and he loved me and he took that sacrifice and I love him. Yeah, Who are you to tell me? Who is Mo Wiggles? Okay, I'm looking on my phone. It's probably a troll. If you're a troll, Mo Wiggles. I'm looking. I'm checking you out, buddy. You, you, you better be nice. I'm just saying. All right, Mo. There you are. Go to channel. It says no subscribers and no videos. You troll! How dare you? How dare you imitate? How dare you imitate someone like that? You could get off my channel, you fraud, you scammer. How dare you? You broke my heart. You broke my heart. We were supposed to be friends, but you lied to me. You told me you were famous. You told me you had money. You told me you had women. Thank you. You're nobody. That's right. You're nobody. So you pretend to be someone else and you're not. That's what I said. Now go do something else. So that's not the real Mo Wiggles. No, it's not, Jason Guacamole. No, it's not. Hi, Stay Puff Marshmallow Woman. They say I'm their goddess. Well, pay tribute to your goddess. Pay tribute. Make me feel like a queen. He's not the real Mo. No, he's not. He's a fraud, I tell you. A fraud! How dare you be a fraud? You were supposed to give me the giggles. Men. You win them, you lose them. That's just how it is. I know Jennifer Lowell. I know you're heartbroken. No rebittable vibe, Ryan. No, it's not. I don't even know who he is. Can I put a sheet over myself? I'm no couch. I may sometimes sit on a couch, but I'm not a couch. Who do you think you are? You're a mop. A dirty fucking mop. Go wash the floor. Nobody wants you here. You mop. Before I ring you out. Go. <laughs> the Stave Pup Marshmallow Woman models their body after me. 
Is that you, baby? That was me. Joe Giggles, my Mo, hubby. Mo Wiggles. Yeah. Joe Giggles. You're so hot, my love. I love you, baby girl. Ooh, I like you. Oh, I really like you. Sexy girl. Mo runs an internet show from his studio in Germania. Oh, wow. Germania. I'd love to be in Germania. That'd be amazing. Anyone else watching snow fall outside? No. There is no snow. I'm putting that in the universe. How many pizzerias in my area? Why would I know that? Thank you, Shelly Roper. I'm watching snow melt outside. <gasps> you brag. Hi, Joe the cat. AJ Dante. Jason? Yes, that was Jason back there. He's waking up, I think. I think he wants to perform with me finally. Mo is a gorgeous looking man. Okay. 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 But I got a gorgeous. Aren't you glad you left Boulder before it burned down? That was scary. Did you see the nose? Jesus lamp. I don't know what you're talking about. I want Jason to get a gig at a pizzeria. <coughs> Piggly Wiggly. Piggly Wiggly? Yeah. I'm your little Piggly Wiggly baby. No, I love Piggly Wiggly. Ooh. 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 We are expecting 9 to 13 inches by morning. Ooh, I wouldn't mind expecting 9 to 13 inches by morning, too. Mm. Who will Jason be tonight? My love, mm. the butt warmer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Perfect for him. Oh, discount pizza sounds like a great idea. Discount pizza? No, if I was going to get anything, I'd get a DiGiorno. I don't do that discount pizza very much. Gives me heartburn. The pig is a wonderful grocery store. Yes, it is. Laugh out loud is he's not performing. Maybe he will, maybe he won't. I don't know. It depends on what he wants to do. I ain't his boss. I'm his submissive. He's my master. There must be a local pizzeria in your area, Jason. They need to leave now. Or boot them. Please. Pizza Hut. Yeah, po please boot them. It's okay, it's someone else. Don't worry. <coughs> I, I, I got them. Thanks. AJ. Listen, AJ. Alex Jones, okay? Listen, 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 listen. Never mind, you're not worth it. If Jason has not Revelina, don't come in camera, Jason. <gasps> they want Revelina. Mm -hmm. That's true. Oh, whatever her name was. It is Revelina. Mm -hmm. How do you guys keep your romantic spark? Well, let me tell you. Me and Jason have known each other for 10 years. Okay? And even though I was married at the time, I was always highly sexually... 
attracted to him mm. and he was to me too and we always like communicated really well together like we really hit it off in communication like we should work together or something or you know but we always kept it on a brother and sister in Christ status. Mm -hmm. And he wasn't as knowledgeable as me regarding the Bible. And that was really nice. And I w was... <sighs> I, I found out that he had just as much as faith I have in Jesus Christ. So, when I became single, he made his move, and I reciprocated as yes, and we spent several months staring at each other on Skype mm -hmm. and wanting to eat each other up. Mm -hmm. So, we have a really good sexual heat with each other, because we like how each other looks so much. And we just want to devour each other all the time. <laughs> so, and that doesn't really leave because he's so cute. Mm. And, you know, he loves the hell out of me and I love the hell out of him. And, mm. and <sighs> mm. he's, <laughs> oh my. Mm. He, um, <laughs> Can't concentrate, baby. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. He um <laughs> held on a second. I think it's just we have just a really good sexual chemistry with each other and a love for Christ together and mm -hmm. a natural friend chemistry together that is just like we can't keep each other's hands off each other. Mm -hmm. Son of Solomon. Ah, oh, Christian lives matter. Thank you. Can we get Revelina and Ramona boxing? No. Jesus Christ. Jason would kill Pete. Jesus Christ. Revelina and Ramona boxing. Wow. We would kill Pete. No, I wouldn't kill Pete. You would kill Pete. You're so much stronger than him. No, oh my God, no. I, we don't know that. But probably, but I wouldn't kill him. Come God on. made man and woman and called it good. That's right. That's right. That would be wild. No! Don't encourage that. That's violence. Mm -hmm. The meek shall inherit the earth. Cross dressing. Boxing. <laughs> Dressing, boxing. That, that, that would be funny, though. It would be funny. Oh. They both wear brown skirts. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> There's Rev. Oh, bitch. <laughs> <coughs> oh, my God. And, and Pete would be like, ouch. Ouch. <laughs> You do it better. Ouch. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's hilarious. Right? <laughs> Jesus. Well, are you okay, honey? I don't think so. Are are you are you okay, the Reverend Hicks? This is this is, <laughs> this is the reverend of my church, and he's beautiful, I'll put this on and you. I'm making him feel a little bit more comfortable. My titties. 
he he's just showing way too much skin, guys. Gap in the cat. I, am I good? I don't. Oh my god, I don't feel. Gavin so good. is streaming. Gavin, everyone's talking about him. Oh my him god, right there now. he is. He hasn't been in here for a long time. Gavin, come here. Come here, Gavin. Gavin, boy. Boy. Come here, baby. What are you looking at, lady? <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Shit. Oh, my God. I look so bad. Hi, baby boy. Yeah, <laughs> baby boy. Hi. Hi, handsome bear. Yeah. There he is. Come up here. Gavin. See, here's the thing. G-Man was here today, and when every time G-Man's here, he hides because he's not used to him. Gavin, boy. Come so here. he has to smell Gavin. the whole perim perimeter of our room to make sure we're safe and that nothing is out of place. Gavin Kai Cat. He has to investigate. Yeah, Re everyone's saying Reverend Dode. What? They're loving on you right now. Oh, thanks. Hi. Gavin, come here. <laughs> Will he ever get Gavin? He's never he's he hasn't been here for a long time. Gavin, could you come here, please? He's just smiling and blinking, dear. Gavin! Gav! Gavin! Where well, are you? Where are you? Gavin! <laughs> I can't. He's leaving now. Okay, fine. <laughs> we get no Gavin. He ran off. Jason cosplaying Walking Dead. <laughs> oh, Norman Reedus, my eyes are starting to look like Norman Reedus eyes, and it's bizarre. Oh right? my God, torn rage! Grow up! I didn't encourage nothing on him. He's a good boy. Gavin, come here. Gavin. He just doesn't like people that he doesn't know. Gavin. Could we set up a celebrity mox and batch between Rev and Nader? No. What? Nader would kill you. Yeah, you just say these things like you know them. How the fuck do you know that he would kill me now? You say that I would kill Pete. How the fuck do you know that? You don't know shit. Baby. You don't know shit. Baby. About me. I might slaughter Nader. I have watched Fight Club probably more than you have, sir. What I know how to size a point? motherfucker up. Are you kidding me? I've Na actually Nader is a fucking twig. I've actually been in Nader real fights. Nader is a fucking twig. Have you been in real fights? No. I have. I, no, I haven't. I know how to size someone up. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're, you're like, really, that's... That's right, Black Poodle. Nader has stabbed people. That's right. Just do something really, like... He's a foreigner. That's right, I said it. Ooh, is there another one? No. Ah, damn. I'll get an, another pack soon. <laughs> oh, baby. Yeah, it's, it's kind of bullshit that my wife can make comments like that sometimes. Like she knows some guy can beat me up or something. You don't know that. I'm very protective of my men. Yeah, you don't know if Nader could kick my ass. Why do we have to fight a, a talk about this stuff? Whoever asked that question, stop that. That was, that, that was to cause a fight. No. That was a trick question. That was a trick question. You. There's
you're saying because they set up a boxing match. Not that he would kick my ass or that well, I would kick you, his ass. Well, you know what? No one's setting up any boxing match because that's violence and the meek inherit the earth. No one's doing that. Well, I'm just fucking not in shape anyway. So what's the fucking point? Hey. And I'm 30, gonna be 30 fucking eight. I love you. I don't want to see you hurt. You're beautiful. Yeah, you're assuming someone would hurt me. I love you. What if I was the one doing hurting? I don't want to hurt But I love you, either. baby. I... I want you to be okay. Yeah, that's good. No one. I'm not answering any more Rev versus who what questions. I ain't doing that. No, Go I... play your game somewhere else. No, and I'm a pacifist, man. I can kick pretty much anyone's ass. That's the truth. But I would never do it. What are the plans for 2022? Nothing. Oh my. Nothing. I've answered that question. If you want to see my 24 hour marathon to get the answer, go to Twitch on Shani Needs Love. And then you can see it, my 24 hour marathon. And I tell people a bunch of times what my plans are for 2022. <laughs> Baby Bear Farm, stop that shit. I don't think you're who you really are. I think you're phony. Is this part of the performance? Maybe. What are we supposed to know? I want to play games with you, Shanny. Oh, Joe. My husband is here. But a final word that I could say on the situation, I snap Nader in half. Okay. No, but skinny guys box till they're a fucking hamburger. That's actually true. That statement from Fight Club. That's why I don't want to stop mm -hmm. stop you from it. I don't want you to be a hamburger. Okay. You're my English muffin. <laughs> That's sweet. Mm. Cover me with your hair, will not you? That's hot as shit. Mm. That's really hot. Ladies, you never cut your hair because, okay, if you can cover your man's face with your hair while you're kissing, that's extremely erotic to the male. <coughs> that's true. You want the rest of that? You can have it. If you want it. Mm. You can have it. Huh. As you can tell, I am not feeling too good, folks. I thought I think I got round two of uh, Omicron. Oh no! <laughs> You're okay, baby. Oh, well, mate, I won't die. We support you here, baby. Yeah, I won't die. I'll be your nurse. I just ain't feeling good. Thank you, Jennifer Howell. I know I'm being sweet. I love, I love my man. Yeah, G-Man wasn't kidding. I look horrible, like malnourished and and bad. My baby, you, I'm gonna make you a big juicy hamburger. You and you're gonna great. love it. Thank you. Like really good, like healthy Mediterranean coloring. Even like, damn, you look really healthy. Thank you. You do. You do. And and the boobage is perfect. It's like perfect. Looks so good. Thank you. Yeah, it's true. No, I would never have short hair. Not again. The bob cut. Nah. No thanks on that. I don't like looking like a boy. No, Bob. I feel like a boy when I have you short did, hair. But you didn't you didn't look male at all though. The bob cut. Well, not that's not short to me. I mean, like really short <laughs> hair. I I feel like I'm a boy. Oh yeah. And okay. I like I like feeling like a dame. You know what I mean? Well, I have never seen. I I self-identify as a classy, long haired fashionista, buxom, mm. fashionista. Mm -hmm. But sometimes I don't give a damn how I fucking look, <laughs> cause I'm middle aged. 
for Gavin. That's the type of girl that I like to look like. Gavin just came in and left. I look like I, I came from a brothel and I had a lot of men. <clears throat> and I've smoked a lot of cigarettes and I drink a lot of whiskey. That's how I like looking. I'm that type of lady. You do. That's hot. <laughs> Blue hair, Shani, still the best look in my opinion. Oh, you he can tell you about my blue hair, darlings. Yeah, I bet you won't do it for me. He he can tell you about my blue hair. He he loved me in blue hair. Yeah, I, I like blue hair. I think it brings my eyes out more. It does. It does. And I love bringing out my eyes cuz they're just so pretty. I mean. Ain't I pretty? <laughs> you ruined a moment. You won't hear it on there. You ruined a moment, darling. You won't hear it on there. Oh my god. You won't hear it. I bet you will. You might smell it though. Ah, oh, Jesus. I don't think so. Why couldn't you just squeeze your butt cheeks or something? Excuse me. I have a stomach ache starting to. Is Rev okay? I'm sick. I'm definitely ill. He's not feeling good. No, I'm not. And I am here to watch and entertain you folks. Maybe. <laughs> he probably did shat himself. He should check. <laughs> oh, did they hear it? Jesus Christ. I told you they heard it. I'm sorry. <laughs> That choker, though. I know. <laughs> Sorry. I love you, dear. I love you, too. <laughs> oh. I heard it, Rev. Check your pants, dude. <laughs> They're burning you, baby. All right. Apologize. <laughs> Did we get that treat stream set up? No, we have not. Ava Love, hello. <laughs> I know you have cats. We're thinking of building my mother a catopy for her three cats outside on the porch. Ooh, poopy farts. Oh my god. Poopy Might farts. need to go wash. <laughs> Bet he feels better after that one. He, see, Joe knows. I gotta go back. Joe knows. He knows. <laughs> Someone's bacon brownies. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Damn, you took a big hit. Yeah. Hey. Shanny, I'm a woman. But you're called Joe the Cat. Wouldn't it be J-O? I apologize. I can't tell. Sex, I'm sorry for misgendering you. I'll remember. You do look like you're having fun. I am. 
Yes. <laughs> Only cause my bl my main is blocked, lovely. Well, what's your main called? <coughs> Big hits get me drooling. <laughs> We've all been there. Stanley Williams, 19K, time to make some Schwann's donuts. <coughs> Swan's donuts. <laughs> <laughs> Go to the bathroom, dear. <laughs> oh my God, that smells. Sorry. Oh my God, you nasty man. <laughs> oh. <coughs> This is why we we won the Lulz Cows of the Year, dear. I guess. You're right. And I take said position, and I'm fine with it. I'll be a professional Lulz Cow. I'll be like Chantel. <laughs> <laughs> Watch him come in and say, I shit myself. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> oh, <sighs> what can I say, people? <laughs> Who is what guy? I would send a treat stream. Aw, that's sweet of you, Black Poodle. That's sweet of you. I think he's puking or he may just be coughing his coughs do sound like puke he'll feel better after his poo I guarantee it you need to stop I hope he feels better too stop waving revs part around no I'm going to make sure that it goes away from me <laughs> Hi, honey. <coughs> you feel better? He came right in behind me. Oh, the Gavin boys. There was no shit. Oh. There's no shit. Oh. That's a boy. It's my Gavin baby boy. Yeah. That's a boy. My <coughs> baby. That's a boy. Oh, I love you. You're a handsome boy. Yes, you're a handsome boy. I missed him. Oh, I love you, my handsome man. That's a baby boy. That's a baby boy. He's a handsome man. You want to go, daddies? I love you, dad, honey. All right. I love you, dad, honey. This You'll go to daddy. Oh, this is a baby boy. They're going to cuddle. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is a baby. I cuddle him to get him warm. And cuddle. <sighs> Gavin the man's man. It's a boy. It is a boy. <coughs> you wish you could show me your cats? Go on Instagram and look me up. Go look it up. We have some troll in here, by the way. Wow. Have you guys that. tried those flavored disposable vapes? <coughs> yes. Yeah, 
I love them. The mango one. The mango. Oh, that mango one was so good. Delicious. I don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> I don't talk about said person. I want nothing to do with said person. Amen. <sighs> I'm a huge fan of the strawberry banana. I've, did we have the strawberry banana? I don't think so. No, but those are nice. Yeah. I really like them. I would love a, a, a tobacco vape. That would be nice. That'd be real good. Yeah, right now. Yeah. Yeah, it would be nice. <coughs> Besides the few troll streams lately have been pretty chill. I enjoy your content. Thank you, Bejeweled Christian. Thank you. Ah, uh, Can Rev cook? Yeah, he can cook. Thank you, baby. I get the Flum brand. I don't smoke. I love my lungs. Well, my body's a temple and... According to Israel, every temple needs smoke. <sighs> I'm only doing what the Lord commands. <laughs> Amen. Will I be doing the cooking stream again soon? Yes. Oh, I will look, I will look. <coughs> oh my God, he looks like Sam. He's so cute. Oh my god, he's so cute. Look at this face. Little baby. Oh my god, look at the face. Doesn't he look like Sam? Sam? Sam who? Chantel's cat. Oh, that's Sam? He's, uh, he's got that little fluffy face. Yeah, I guess so. Very cute, though. Uh... There. Hey, come back. Focus on my face, camera. Can you focus on me, camera? Focus. It came out of focus. I'm back. He stretches out like a noodle. He is my noodle, if you know what I mean. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh my god, that's so nice. I like you. I really like you. I really like you. Yeah, I really, really like you. Ooh. My god, that bun bun. Mmm. Really good. Mmm. Very weird. Mmm. Very hot. Mmm. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Mm. <gasps> mm. Oh. Mm. I've attempted homemade treslish for the first time tonight in the Instapot. Hopefully it will be good. <clears throat> Oh, my G. That sounds so good. Mm -hmm. You're going to step outside for smoke. I 
it's classy. Mm -hmm. ZD is the best. Oh. I may have to use Instagram just to reach out to you, girly. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Because you can't show pictures on YouTube. Oh. What a baby. Oh, whoa, baby. So cute. <laughs> I love kitty cats. Kitty cats are adorable. Mm -hmm. They're special. I love them so much. Me too. I love them so much. How are you guys? All right, we got to go and play some Chrono Trigger. I need... I need to beat this game. <clears throat> I really want to beat this game. It's really important to me. And I'm going to have fun doing this. I, I, I hope you guys stay with me and have fun with me too. Oh, you have a guinea pig. Yay. I will play any damn game I want. <laughs> That's right. You want a guinea pig and trying to convince your boyfriend? Okay. Your guinea pig can eat the leftovers of your produce. There. And you can use their drop-ins for manure. So you just have to use a, a bed-in that is biodegradable. Oh, you're about to cut up and eat a mango now, dude. I know what that's about. Get those terpenes, man. Mine loves spinach and kale. Oh my god, mine loves all veggies. It's it's amazing. I love him. I have a great guinea pig. If you want to see um, selfies of Gavin... You can look up my hubby. He posts a bunch of pictures of Gavin all the time, honey. If you want to put your links down. I don't have, well, I got rid of like all my social media. like Even Facebook? No, I. but I don't put my Facebook out there. It's oh, like his Facebook private. is private. I apologize. Yeah. We should start a Gavin instagram or something uh, oh, okay. mm -hmm. and a gavin youtube mm. gavin the kit kat we should do that okay. he will be a famous kit kats good boy. he is a good boy he he is the best boy in the entire world i love that cat me too I love that cat. He's beautiful. He's wonderful. Mm -hmm. He loves me. Mm -hmm. Most importantly, he loves me. Mm -hmm. And I love him too. <laughs> and, and Jason adores that cat. Yes. And, and and we just cuddle each other all night long. And it's the most cutest, wonderfulest thing in the entire world. It is. It's the best thing ever. K. 
cat toy reviews? Well, see, here's the thing. <laughs> if I was doing cat toy reviews, that would require watermelon. Yeah. Because she's the one who loves the cats or the toys the most. Yeah. Gavin will sniff them for a moment, maybe do this a little bit. But watermelon, she loves toys. Because she's a girl, and every girl loves their toy. Uh, mm -hmm. <gasps> Me, I have a boy toy, and he does everything. Everything. Anything I ask him, he'll do. Huh. And it feels good every time. <laughs> Dark chocolate Kit Kat. Oh. Yum. I have a cookies and cream pop tart. Cats are overrated. <gasps> How dare you? Mm -hmm. I just don't understand. You just don't understand. I've converted a lot of people to cats before, though. Mm -hmm. I've been taking care of cats my whole life. They're everything to me. And I'm a pink Kit Kat. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, they've had the, kick, the catnip cat treats. Yeah. Hi, Gavin Bear. Is he here? Yeah, he's eating these sardines that are oh, of over course, there. He's having food. Good. Yes. That's good. He's having his foods. His foods. <laughs> he enjoys his foods because he he's a good boy. That's right. You're a good boy. Mm -hmm. I love you. You're my baby. Mm -hmm. You're my baby boy. Boy. Yeah. You're my baby boy and I love you. My little cabin. So cute. My little Gavins. Mm -hmm. He's a good boy. Yeah. Try me then. Gavin, come here. Someone needs to learn how to love you. Mm -hmm. Come here, baby. He came That's right up. Right. He loved you. He came right up. Listen to me. I am not a bad kitty cat. I am a good kitty cat, and I love you, and I snuggle you, and I'm soft, and when you're hurting, you pet me, and you always feel better because I have a healing spirit. He does. I am a wonderful kitty cat. Love me, for I am Gavin, the Kit Cat. Baby, yes. <laughs> yeah, we give them fish. Mm -hmm. We give, mommy gives me fish all the time. Because <laughs> she loves me. Here's your baby. All right, here you go. Good boy. My baby boy. He's a good boy. Do you give your cats cat food? Yes. He doesn't look miserable. Hi, Dark Giver. How are you? How are you? Are you okay? Is everything doing you good today? I'm doing good. 
I need to play Chrono Trigger. <laughs> you took Gavin. Yeah. He's my boy. And I love him. He boy. is your boy. He's my boy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. He's a very good boy. And he is my friend. Gavin never looked. Ah, oh, Ron Channel. Oh my god, I didn't mean to switch that over. Jesus. Let's see. Hold on, I'm turning that down real quick. I, I just I just flipped on Chrono Trigger. As you can see right here. Because this is a good game. This is a good cold. game. No, it's not cold. Mangoes are fire. Yes. Yes. You see, time is going by. You want to hear a little bit of it? Get in the mood to play how epic this game is? I mean... How could you not love this type of music here, man? It's epic. And then you got robots in this game. You got a purple-haired girl. You got a frog with a sword. And then you got Croto here, and there's not really much character development with him other than he's just fighting to save the world. She's got a little bit of character development. I think her mom's sick. She kind of stays in a chair the whole time. She's got a lot of character. Lean here. Or Marl, however you want to go and say her name is. She... And, and he's got quite a character development. Because he's just trying to defeat Lavos. You know? And, and then there's this brilliant, like, thing that we defeated a long time ago. Cause, Cause, you have to, right? I, 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 I need to know, cause Chrono right now he's dead, so we need to get Chrono back here, and and and, and like save the world from the evil that is Lavos. Where the hell is my, my, um... There we go. So, I have my Xbox controller right here. You know, it's pink. And it, it, it has a dead name on it. Right here. It, it says, if you can see, Shanny for Christ right there you know on the bottom there but you know that that's just how life is you know you, you win them you lose them you you win them again you know what i mean and 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 this is what that game represents is you win them you lose them and you just just keep moving forward in life because that that's what's truly what matters in life is is just keep moving forward that's why i want to beat this game so much because i want to move forward with my life and play another fucking game but i want to beat this one first because it, it needs to be beaten. You know what I mean? Time egg. Okay. <sighs> Shit. I 
I didn't save. No. Are you kidding me? Do I have Chrono? I have to have fucking Chrono. Do I have Chrono Doll? Do I? Do I? Please, Jesus. Well, you know what? We're going to find out. We're going to go to the end of time and see what is said here. Because we were supposed to be on Death's Peak, but I guess I forgot to save because I was up 24 hours with you guys here on YouTube and Twitch. Revisonic fan. Maybe. Let's see what he says here. Where are we? That is the Chrono Trigger, a time egg. Should you wish to try to hatch it, the one who created your weens of time can tell you away. Okay. Okay. So I guess we got to do the same thing we did. So to the future, I'm trying to get to where I was, which was Death's Peak. So if you need to pause to see what is red, it's okay. I'm just trying to progress in the storyline. Do I have to do that whole trying to get Chrono thing again? Oh, Jesus. Yes, let me in. Alright. I like how he floats still. Alright. Because we turned him off, but now he's alive. Ah, uh, we do have to get that damn doll. So we gotta punch this robot again like four times and try to do the dance good wish me luck so I want to know what's next in the storyline so I'm sorry I'm rushing through this but all right we gotta go to the present and then That thing is gone. The little, like, sand trap thing. Did I beat that? I didn't think I beat it. Alright. Oh, land. Why aren't you landing? There we go. Alright, so... We gotta go to this robot dude. And get the chrono... Doppelganger thingy. Because that's what you have to do. Alright. Bam. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Aha. Yes. All right. Thank you. And I'll just do one more for safe measure. God, that was fucking annoying. Ah, come on, baby. 
Come to me. Yes. Dude, come on. Bring me. Bring me down. Thank you. No! Over here. There we go. We go over here. No. Ugh. This is gonna be a pain in the ass. Alright. Yes, play the game. X, A, laugh, surprise. Okay. Oh, A. Yes. Laugh. Aha, I did it. How about that? First try. Aha. There we go. Now. Back to the future. <sighs> Land and Go over here. There we go. See? I'm doing good. I don't need to go upstairs. Why would I go over here? I'm doing good. I'm proud of myself. I'm very proud of myself. What? Okay, I don't know what's going on, but yeah, I'm just continuing to play my uh, game. I'll just ignore that. Whatever that meant. Oh, yay. All right. And then I turn this stupid dude off. I gotta go to Belthazar. I gotta go to the end of time. Oh my god. No, I didn't even pick up the identical doll. That's what it was. Oh my god. I gotta go to Chrono's house. You tried to request me on Animal Crossing? Yeah, I will... Um... I gotta get on my Switch in order to do that. I'll do that soon. After this stream, I'll get on it and look at it, and I'll, uh, I gotta go to a present. Jesus. I forgot to go to Chrono's house. Don't I feel like a dumb dumb? <sighs> There's mom. This is a very dramatic moment. If you didn't watch this with me yesterday or the day before, it's kind of confusing. No. Well, yeah, you can you can make letters to people. 
You can give letters to all your friends on Animal Crossing. I think how you establish it is you have to go to their island or they have to go to your island. And then um, you can start sending letters to each other. And I guess that'll be like a form of email. So, yeah. I'm going to open up my island and then everyone can come over and then you'll have my email and then you can send me emails. And then if any trolls send me emails, well. Well. Let me tell you. I will read them out live and laugh at you. Alright, I got the doppel doll. Key cats. I just got the red for dreaming. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, the bed for dreaming. Oh, I, I thought you meant red light. See, my 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 thoughts are going to very naughty places. I apologize. The rose bed, it's so pretty. And then you can go dream and go off to someone's wonderful land and it's wonderful. Oh yeah, the future, that's where we go. There we go, and now we can do the cutscene with this guy right here. See, I got there fast. Because we already did this. Sh oh my god. I went up the stairs again. Oh, Delta 8 in the short-term memory loss I have. <laughs> I'm getting jealous now. <laughs> Death Peak harbors a pa power capable of restoring the slain to life. But the power to reverse death is not one easily invoked. The need must be great. And the person's existence of the utmost importance. And what's more, you'll need a double. Okay, we've already seen that. Yes, yes, that's right. I want to go in there. Lord, forgive me for my envy. Oh my. Shame on you. Naughty. Naughty. Ah! Yes, I will switch you off. All right. Switch. Yes. What happens if you let him sleep, though, and not switch him off? Send anything. Can you have him as a friend or something? We must investigate that eventually. You're hitting some crunch berries wax. It tastes like the name even. Oh my god, that's awesome, dude. I'm new in my s face. Still, I slip up. It happens. It happens. We all do that sometimes. But all that matters is we come back. Because we'll always come back. Because he's beautiful. All right. Ah, son of a bitch, I went when the... Okay, I gotta listen to the sounds. I did it again. See? I already slipped up. Gotta wait. Alright. 
no sound. It's blowing. No sound. Keep going. There we go. We did it. And then I remember there's this in the footprints. Yeah. And I couldn't get that chest up there, and it really made me mad. I can't trust the Bible itself, though, but I love my Lord and carry him in my heart. Hey, you know what? As long as you believe in Jesus Christ, you're in, man. So don't worry about that. But I will say it's got a lot of meat in it. And you may learn how to, you know, do better in your faith if you do read it. Because it has some good advice, ultimately. That's just my opinion. You don't have to take my word for it. Ooh, I'm gonna kiss this handsome man, Magus. Yeah. Oh, you like Magus, don't you? Why not? He flies. He's like Superman. And, you know, he's not bad looking. He's kind he's got a Vegeta like look, okay? And I really liked Vegeta on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Thank you, Joe. All right. No. All right. Yes. Walk. No. Oh my god. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. I'm just trying to get to the cave. Come here. You skeletor. You ain't death. I gotcha. There you go. Got it. Luca's level increased. Yay, everyone gets their boo-boo kisses. Oh, oh, right there. All right. Ah, oh, more of these guys. All right. Take on more of them. These brilliant, what are they called again? Ironside? Macabre. Oh, they're called Macabre. Well. It's one of those words. Ah. No, I'm not, I, I, I came on just a couple hours ago. And I gave a nice talking to at the beginning of the stream. And now we're playing Chrono Trigger and I'm like trying to kill Lavo's creepy spawn in a really stupid way. Because I'm not strategizing. And I just died. I just went in there without thinking, without strategizing, and I died. I'll be right back, guys. Well, guys, I'm back. I'm back. <sighs> Let 
Let me tell you, sometimes when you get in a fight with someone, especially in things like this, you, 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 you have to, how do I put this? You have to strategize in life. So I'm going to strategize because I'm going to be honest with you guys right now. I really did look that shit up. On GameFacts.com. <coughs> because I'm old. And I forgot. But I decided. That was David Tennant. The doctor. Not my doctor. That's Matt Smith. But that's still the doctor to me. And he's a wonderful person. Anyway, the Reverend Hicks is signing off, and it's just you and me right now, because I died. I died, and I'll be honest. I wasn't happy about it. Chrono Trigger was your favorite brother's favorite. Hello, Darren Ty Dixon. How are you? Maybe you could use range attacks. No. It's not how you beat him at all. I'll show you. I'll show you. All right. Let's continue this. See, we get the clickety clackety <coughs> of that. All right, we're now in. See, you have to do this and avoid the shell and hit his head. We have to hit the anus looking thing there. You see, <coughs> and the and and. We have to heal, too, so I'm going to use these Lapis on everyone right now. Because we want to heal. And then we're going to go back. There we go. <coughs> oh, I'm asleep. All right. Well, we're, we, no, we don't want to do that. That's stupid. No, we want to attack the head. All right. No, flamethrowers. <coughs> ah, everything of hers is two. Two. All right, fine. We'll attack with that. All right. I need to do another lapis thing. All right, let's attack the butthole again. The first time I've seen it since my surgery. Oh, I'm so sorry about your brother. God bless you, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. Ah, <coughs> oh, you fuckface. No, I am confused. I don't want to be confused. Pansia. And then I'll do another lapis. And another one. And one more. Ah, <laughs> oh, they are a pain in the ass. They literally are a pain. In the asshole. Ah, <coughs> oh, he's dead. Good. The 
that's okay, Darren. I'm fine with everything. I was a caregiver, so I love talking to people. As long as they're kind and generous and nice, I'm I'm fine. Ooh, giga arm. That goes to uh this guy right here. <coughs> Bam. Oh. Oh, we got some chesticles here. A brave sword. Can we give it to Frog? Yes. We do give it to Frog. Okay. They're just giving us all... Oh! Hello! <laughs> yes! Baby, did you fart? Yes. Oh my god, it smells like onions or something. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with me. Uh, do I have to do anything to help you? Not really. Alright. <coughs> my poor pudding in face. Mm. Oh, I have... Oh, you see how they tricked me and they thought I could go to the stair right there? I can't. It's blocked off. You see that? Ah. You got me, Square. You tricked me. I, I have your hair, Sarah. Oh my god, I love it. You got gorgeous hair then. I admire a girl with that. <gasps> what? Oh, you bastards! I have to go back in that cave. Do you see that? I'm blocked off. And it's down here. Where the hell? This is so messed up. Thank you, Sarah. Ah, oh, hey. If I can entertain you and keep your time motivated, I will, Darren. I love to help people. I was a caregiver for years. Oh my god, Jason, William, Egroff. Your want. tutor is tooting. I don't know what you want. Oh my god, you know you're really in love with someone when they fart around you and you're completely comfortable. Okay. <laughs> Obviously not. <laughs> I'm, I'm good at this? Thank you so much. Come on, baby. Ah, Magus increased the level. That's cool. Alright, let me get this girl all kissy face. Alright. Do I have to do the anus again? Oh my god. Thank god I don't have to do the anus. All right, how the fuck do we get down here? The hell? All right. Oh, it like opened up here too. That's insane, man. Oh, we can save. Lovely. All right, we'll save down here. Oh my. <laughs> My man needs some bread. Oh. We'll have bread tomorrow, that poor guy. Uh. 
I'm planning on um, making a nice salad with some nice focaccia. Like, I'm going to take a Hayden sickle. That is Magus's. So anyway, since I'm here, about my salad, I'm going to get a bag of salad, right? Okay. And then I'm going to go get the antipasto that I love so much at the grocery store, right? And I'm going to put it in there because it's got amazing dressing with this antipasto salad that's so fucking incredible because I love antipasto salad. And then I'm going to add some shredded mozzarella to that <coughs> stuff. And some additional artichoke hearts with some focaccia and maybe a little butter on it. I think it would be very good. Oh. Anyway. I absolutely love salad. Did you toot again? No. Oh. You giggling, though. Yeah, I giggled. I have a girl coming on to me. That's cool. I know. I'm very happy for you. I know, right? Yep. It's like, cool. I need to use a lapis. All right. That sounds like my aunt's recipe, but she always adds some Dukes, if you ever heard of it. If I ever heard of Dukes. Oh, I know about Dukes mayonnaise. It, there is no other mayonnaise but Dukes. That's how much I know about Dukes mayonnaise. Dukes mayonnaise is the most amazing thing in the entire world. And if Dukes mayonnaise would like to sponsor me... I would talk the shit out of Duke's mayonnaise all the time and promote it on every fucking video of mine uh -huh. because I genuinely love it so much and I think since I love it so much, the company should pay me. Anyway. Duke's all the way, that's right. Chrono Trigger is tough. Yeah, it is. Oh my, Sarah. That's right. I love it. I'm gonna try it with some Duke. See how it is. I'll try it. I do. That I do. Ah, no. My, my, Sarah. Dark bomb. Megaton bomb. Oh, we gotta try the bombs. We gotta try that. Bomb, bomb. I can carry your bomb? Oh my. Naughty girl. Oh, the foot in here is icy and slick. Be careful, fall, and you have to start over. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. No! Freaking ding 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 And now I have to kill these things. But this is good for leveling, I guess.
See, there's nothing here. Oh, poo poo. Oh my God, Jason. Do you know what I'm stuck on? No. There. I, okay. So it's this rocky cliff that's very narrow. And I have to try to not slide down it. Oh, yeah, I think I remember seeing Brian that, yeah, broke him nuts. You have PTF5? Oh, my gosh. I'm so sorry. I have mine in the morning, so... Not tomorrow morning. Thank God. Yeah, thank God. I have another day to be lazy. Well, no, not lazy, just recover. You know, honey. Yeah. Recover. I'll be. I'll, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ugh. You know, I really should celebrate that. Jesus. Keep going down, guys. Does it stop? Nope. I love you. I love you, baby. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna die. <coughs> I did die. I... Ah, oh, son of a... Son of a beeswax. Ah, what am I using? Fiddlestick. <laughs> Get there. Alright. Fuck you, dude. You're dead, man. You are so dead. How dare you hurt my girl, man. I wouldn't allow it happen. Oh! Oh! Oh, they come back! <coughs> These ugly, like, blood things, whatever they are. Blood yolks. So gross. That's disgusting, folks. No one wants a bloody fucking yoke. Blood yoke. A yaksha blade. What is a yaksha blade? Yaksha. <coughs> I don't think anyone can use the yaksha blade. That's for chrono triggers, so they're getting you all excited for chrono with that. Well back. done, Square. Yeah. Well done. <coughs> Push the shell, climb the shell. Push the shell, climb the shell. Okay. Push the shell, climb the shell. Oh, that shell. <coughs> <sighs> I hate this thing. doing a Chrono Cross remake for the next gen? That's awesome, Dark Giver. Are you sure about that? Do you have, like, a link? I'll look that up. I definitely will look that up. That sounds amazing.
Mr. Shanny. Oh my. Well, hello to you. There's a Mr. Shanny and it says, hello, beautiful. <laughs> Men are so naughty. <coughs> You guys are naughty bears. Oh, yeah. Aha. No, I want to move it. No. <coughs> All right, you gotta push a button to climb up it. Aha! I did it. A memory calf. Oh my, Mr. Shanny. He's not a zero. Be nice. Don't be naughty. Be nice. Thank you, stylist Irish Trish. You've been sick throwing up for three days. Feel like I'm dying. Can't keep nothing down. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <coughs> hey, Scott Stevens. How you doing? Thank you. It jingles. <gasps> I'm like a Kit Kat. I think I look cute. I like it. You're new here? That's awesome. Dark hair really suits me. Thank you. I'll go dark. I'm, I, I really want to go dark. I just have to get money to go dark. Because I'm poor. This is it. The summit of Death Peak. Oh. <gasps> You who fear the night and fight the coming of darkness, lend us strength. Oh my god, she did it. She did some witchcraft there. You see that? That's naughty. Chrono. The pendants reacting. It shattered. Oh, my God. Are you telling me they're doing the same thing that happened in the start of Inuyasha? The pendant. It just shatters. Just like uh, Keiko's pendant in Inuyasha. It, like, completely shatters. Thank you, Scott. Ah. Oh. How do you're working me up? Oh my. <laughs> Naughty boy. I'm married. You're going to work him up. That's the point, I see. Aw. I love folding laundry. It's so relaxing. 
I really do because I fold laundry like one of those pros at those clothing stores because I used to be one. So I do it like the pros and it looks gorgeous in the drawers. Mm -hmm. No, what use was it to come so far? No cry. Ella Miss Chrono 2. Sad Chrono. No come back. Chrono, say something. Don't just ignore us. An eclipse? So, okay, let me get this straight here. So the pendant breaks, a portal opens, and they send it right back to the time of right before Chrono dies. So it's like the pendant had some kind of power in it that could open up a portal back through time at the exact same moment of when Chrono died and you need the doppelganger to replace Chrono so they think he died but really it was a doppelganger the whole time so Chrono didn't feel a fucking thing It's pure genius. Too tired, too much pain to really care. I probably hate more up these days than what goes on in the drawers. Ah, <laughs> oh, bless you, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. The Chrono Trigger, the Guru's Time Egg, those, those are our past selves. We really back right at that instant. Just Ella move. We just need to exchange the Doppel Doll for Chrono. There we go. We've got to hurry. Hurry, take Chrono. Save the tearful reunions for later. If we're done all, we must. Let us be on our way. What is Magus going to do? Oh, look at the stars. Oh, it's not stars. It's like twinkle bells. F like Christmas time. He's coming down like Jesus. Oh, he's been resurrected. I'm Jesus. I'm the savior of the world. <sighs> Thank you, Bodega Love. Ava, I know you're a Harry Potter fan. Did you watch the 20th anniversary special? No, I did not. No, I did not. Because I believe in, in authors' right to free speech 
And I believe an author should have control over the thing they wrote. And since they banned J.K. Rowling in that documentary, I refuse to watch it on um, that status because J.K. Rowling should be able to say what she says. Because all she's doing is sticking up for female rights. And that's important because we do have to protect ourselves, ladies. Because men do take advantage and you all should know that. Older female advice. I am an empowered woman. Trisha's teaching me that. And I'm happy that she is. Well, enjoy your pain medication, Darren. Hi, the dork god king. How are you? Deathly Hollows are on right now. <gasps> we need to finish watching Harry Potter, honey. I thought we did watch it. No. <laughs> no, we didn't finish it. <laughs> oh, mighty. Your tutor, I swear. There's something wrong. It smells like onion. <laughs> I didn't eat any onions, though. Um, let's see. <laughs> Could it be that sandwich? Maybe. Maybe the pizza? I mean, I It did. had that American cheese. That's probably it. Probably it. God, you are so lactose intolerant. Uh, it's pretty bad, yeah. You know what? Let's just go vegan, okay? I'm all right with that, yeah. Yeah, we'll just start exploring um, vegan cheese products. Or can I just keep my cheese? You, you can... can keep your cheese. Okay. Of course you can. We'll get you a special vegan cheese. You don't have to go vegan with me. <laughs> yeah. You're sweet. I do want my antipasto salad. I think I deserve it. You do. My best. I want an antipasto salad. You're going to get it. Oh, he's had his medicine. Yeah, I did. You, oh, I am drinking some wild cherry Pepsi right here. It's so tasty. I love it. Ah. Uh, praise Jesus for Pepsi. Mm -hmm. Right. I don't think so, Irish Trish. I may have not have seen it. I apologize. Yes, Rev's fine. He's just resting right now. <gasps> Chrono, it's about time. Chrono back. Chrono, okay? Chrono? Are you a robot? Are you okay? You big dummy. Ah, oh, Luca. She's yelling at him. Mm. You, you wouldn't believe what we had to go through for you. Oh, and she cries, holding him. Mm. You messed up like that again. And you'll have to get yourself out of it. Ah. Oh. That's so sweet. Luca's just crying because they're like childhood friends. Mm -hmm. When you hate to lose your best friend from childhood. Mm -hmm. See? That's essentially Pete's and Foodie Beauty right there. Florida. They probably dated too. Mm -hmm. But they kept their friendship anyway because they love each other. You can love each other and break up. That happens. You know? That happens. My friend Robbie, he was my boyfriend. Yep. 
We were teenage. We had a teenage romance. But we kept in touch with each other over the years, made sure we were okay, because we really did want to keep our friendship, because we do love each other. We do love each other. I'll always love Robbie. You know, I'll always love him, because he was a very good friend. We were friends before we dated. So we kind of fell in love with each other. And then we fell out of love. But we still loved each other and had this mutual respect for each other. And I think that's what's Foodie Beauty and Pete's. And she doesn't want to hurt him. Like, she had she had a hard time leaving Nader. What makes you think she has a hard time leaving Pete's? She likes being friends with her boy, her exes. And I think people need to respect that instead of acting like assholes to her because she's seeing someone who she legitimately loves. Can I be your boyfriend too? Please. Scott, I'm married. Mm. Only girls can apply. Yeah. Those are the rules. Mm. No dicks. Sorry. My husband wants all the pussy. So. Yeah. It's just how it is. And I respect him with that. Yeah, there's no man. <clears throat> so anyway, let's continue on this really beautiful moment right here between Luca and Corona. We had such a terrible time without you. Ma was... And so then we... And even I... Hey, you listening, Chrono? I really... Really can't stand you, you know. Well, fine. I'll get Marl next time with me. Ah, the epicness. Ava. Naughty girl. Old man, so all went well? No, don't thank me. I merely placed a piece upon the board. It was not my hand that moved it. If you would thank someone, thank the ones who cared enough to see their friend return to them. By the way, the wings of time have come looking for you. They seem to have a heart and mind all their own. You wish to fight Lavos, correct? Many paths lie before you. You might choose to leap into that bucket or fly the wings of time to the days of Lavos. Or there is the Black Omen, which now straddles time, seeking to summon Lavos yet again. Such folly, lusting so greedily after power that the power wields you. It is up to you to decide when... And where you will face Lavos. However, do not think that you stand alone. I have had many glimpses, albeit vague of, of events. People and places that will empower you. A forest brought back to life by the sheer determination of a woman in the Middle Ages. The fortress of one of Magus' three former generals in the Middle Ages. A task to be done in the future in a birthplace of machines. A prehistoric stone that will shine with the light of all the ages of the world. The restless spirit of a proud knight slain by Magus in the Middle Ages and lingering even in the present. An object of legend in the Middle Ages that sparkles like a rainbow. Ooh! I love rainbows! See? Listen, my fellow LGBT, we sparkle in the Middle Ages. Imagine these tits in the Middle Ages. 
Wouldn't that be nice? Oh, me as a middle-aged girl. I'll be like a poor little Irish village girl. Please help me. Please help me now. Oh. Oh. You're an English soldier? You're taking over my people? Well, well come here, big boy. I, I, I really want you. See? Oh my God. I'd survive, motherfuckers. I'd survive. Get off of the pussy. Would you ever hang with me at the bodega, Shanny? Gross. That's gross. You're just a blank face. I don't even know how you look like. We haven't even talked. Can you just get to know a lady before you, you know, solicit me? I mean what women want my rocket is bigger <gasps> I'm sorry sir I'm not a size queen Sh Shani how do you feel about fur and latex Why would you want to kill animals and latex you could have allergies to? How big is your rocket? I have no rocket. Girl, you're on fire with the voices. Thank you. Is it a red rocket? Thank you, honey, for the marvelous fart. That really did help turn the men off. That's good. Yes. <clears throat> Speak to your companions. Some among you may well know the figures behind the events which I have seen. Borrow the might of all these lives throughout the ages. Let their strength become your own. For only then you can... Wait. For only then can you hope to defeat the enemy you face. Such is the power required should you wish to change the future. I will remain here and bear witness to the world's fate. Okay. I'm gonna change my people, man. Chrono, come. Yes. We're taking Chrono. We're taking Maul. She's going to be next to Chrono because, you know, they're in love right here. And then we're going to take Magus because... You know what? Fuck Magus. We're going to take Ayla because Ayla's the shit. Okay? That really stinks, hon. L listen to me. <laughs> Thank you for that, Silas Irish Trish. Shanny needs a real man. Honey, I don't need any man. Let, let, wait, wait, wait. Let's talk about this, okay? Before I start playing Chrono again, okay? We're going to we're going to talk seriously about this shit right here, you know. We're going to talk about this shit, okay? I'm putting the controller down. Listen to me, darlings. I don't need a real man, okay? I don't need any man. I 
can do it myself if I truly want to. I am with this man because I choose to be with this man. Do you get it? He takes care of me. He loves me. He licks my pussy better than anyone ever would. Why would I lose that? I'm a whore. <laughs> and I wouldn't want to waste my time giving it to someone and they don't even give me an orgasm. I know he's a sure deal. He doesn't stop until I do. So there. Do you understand that? I hope you do. Thank you, Irish Trish. Thank you. Oh, and get this, ladies. This is how amazing he is, okay? Speaking of swallowing deposits. Get this, lady. I don't even have to. Get him off if I don't want to. He'd rather me get off than him. Isn't that weird? But at the same time totally amazing because you know I'm spoiled <laughs> I got a mouth of a sea bass well you got a mouth of a filthy sailor I know my worth. Let me let me click on this. There we go. So now I can go anywhere I possibly want. Yes. That's right, Darren Dixon. That is how you treat a lady. Don't be yelling at me if you want to ride on my rocket. You naughty boy. I never said I wanted to ride on your rocket. Maybe I'm afraid of heights. <sighs> okay, so... Just buffalo out my nose, grape juice soda <laughs> out nose. Was not ready for that. <laughs> well, hello, soldier for Satan six six six. How are you? May Jesus Christ help you find Jesus. Oh, let's take off. Where are we going? We could see what we could do in the future. We can change the future. Make things nice there. Or we could start with prehistory. At 65,000 BC. Should we go backwards or forwards in time? Which one should we do? My friend Shakana Jefferson said she wanted to date you. Thank you. Hello. <laughs> I will. This is a bee's knees. Thank you, Dork God King. I feel violated, Shanny. I'm sorry I violated you, Lynn, the cinnamon bum. Oh, I said bum. I meant bon. Sorry. Anyway... 
Prehistory. Rev, save me. Wife trying to kill me. <laughs> get him, wifey. Get him. You caught his ass. <laughs> Too bad the hospital doesn't allow conjugal visits. Well, I mean... You could be doing that, like, one episode, or that one, uh, which Halloween was it? I think it was the second one. The second Halloween, and the nurse, and I think, I think that dude was, like, what was he, like, a janitor or something like that? And they were, like, fucking in the hot tub? In the hospital? And then, and then... Um, Mike Myers, he, he turned up the hot, hot, the hot tub to like boil in and, and they boiled. The woman boiled cause for some reason she couldn't get out of the hot tub fast enough. It really took her a long time, like... <sighs> I mean, but I mean. How high are you? Relaxing? Chill? Leveled? Euphoric? I guess dry mouth. No, I don't, Dorking. I don't do that. I haven't done that since I left Colorado. But I do have Delta 8. And that's legal. Oh, someone's puking, dear. Dear, if you're puking, you need to hydrate. Drink yourself a bottle of water before, you know, after you're done, you know, vomiting. And then, you know, don't eat anything. Go on a brat diet, right? A brat diet. And and then with the brat, brat diet stands for bread, rice, apples, and toast. Okay, like applesauce, applesauce, not apples, applesauce. Okay, and that will cure your stomach from the vomiting. Why won't you run away with me? Why do I have to have the same convo with you every six months like clockwork? You don't appreciate me. Bodega love. Listen, baby. Listen. I'm really happy with who I'm with. Drink something with electrolytes and get heartburn? I don't think so. So of all the wigs a person could wear, why wear that one? Cause I'm in space. You don't appreciate me, Shanny. Bob. Why are you drooling, baby? I wish I had some apple pie moonshine. It's been two years since my last drink. No, you don't. Stay sober. That stuff is dangerous. I puked on it. Run away with me. <laughs> Helps hide you faster than just water. Truth. But I'll be okay. Oh, but but you could. But if they don't get hot bun and they're puking and they they can do it. 
Where are you, Scott Stevens? I saw you in here. I like the moonshine cherries. I've been wanting to find those. I wanted to have them last Christmas, but I found the other moonshine. No. No. That was bad. Puked on on air. It's awful. I felt like a fool. That's why I, that's why I won Lol's Call of the Year. I gave them the best of everything. Anyway. Baby. Let's start from the beginning. Let's go to prehistory. We'll bring Ayla back home. You can bring Jimmy and not Rev. Oh my god, I am not like that. Nowhere near that would I be like that. Wasn't there something here? Hmm. Is there anything here I can do? Just check. Aha! There's that. And I don't know what that is. But I don't think there's anything else around here. So let's go in this hole right here and see what happens. Wish me luck, I might die. We're saving this. Do I have twin sister, Shani? Got buns? I can wear buns for you if you would like. I love buns. I wear them all the time. Ella, smell something. Maybe animal here. I wonder if there are any people here. All right, let's see. Oh my God, what is this place? Oh, there's a save spot. I'm gonna save. We can see what's going on. Let's see. Oh, I can't go in there. What the fuck? I can't go in there either. It tricked me. Can I go in here? No. I can't go in there either. What the? F Why can't I go in anywhere? This makes me super depressed. This village, but no person. Maybe near? I don't know. Thank you, the dork god cane. Shani identifies as a ketchup packet. Do I? You don't talk about that like my queen. What? Okay. Wow, Scott Stevens. You really need to get back on that shit. And learn how to do it correctly. My husband could teach you. By the way. Like, he's really good at it. So I don't leave him because of that. You know, he's my boy toy. <clears throat> Got fishes full of omega-3. Very good for you. See, Sy Silish Irish Tr Trish, she knows. She knows. <laughs> I'm close to be turning straight well. <laughs> Shit, you need to stop saying that about Scott Stevens. Why not? Teach my husband. <laughs> I 
My god, Bodega Love. Bob. I'm just going to ignore you now. I'm just here for games and outfits. Laugh out loud. See, Dark Guyver, he understands me. You know, we've actually talked on my Instagram. You can see it. It says, Shani need love or needs love because I do. I so do need love. You know, I think everyone needs love. So it's on my Instagram, Shani Needs Love. And maybe, you know, we can talk a little bit. And, 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 and maybe you can talk to me over Instagram. Because Dark Guyver has, and he's got a beautiful voice. My husband says it actually feels like a tube. But, you know. Anyway, there's nothing here. There's no one around. It's just empty. Can I go in this at least? I, I can go like a little bit in there. Oh my God. Wait, I went a little further. I went a little further. I went a little further. Ah, oh, God, I, I don't go. I don't go in very well. Why can't I fit in the hole? The hole's too tight. All right, I go up. Oh my God, there's something there. What the fudge? Wait, 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 let me see. Do I go up these stairs right here? And, and, and maybe if I go back here, maybe there's something there? No? What? No, there has to be something there. How do I get that? Ah, oh, they tricked me, those bastards. Uh, no, I went there. See, there's this. And it looks like you do something in there, but you can't. That's just depressing. Rev is a lucky man and Shani is a very lucky woman. Thank you, Stylish Cyrus Trish. I have to go. My nurse came in and I'll be out with all the all of the drugs. Thank you so much for being so entertaining and so pretty too. You're welcome, Darren Dixon. Come back soon, okay? Don't you hide now. Ew! Ew! Soldier for Satan 6-6. Six, six. <laughs> He'll be okay. I have faith. <clears throat> Hi, baby. I mean, people can't stop talking about me, can they? Look at all those monsters. I wonder if they attacked yeah, the village. Yeah, stream, but they can't stop talking about me. Come on, fight monsters, beat all. Fine. Come on, losers. That one guy with a hammer. Falcon Strike. Get him. You love me as a furry? Oh, I definitely would do a furry look. Don't you worry your pretty little head off that. You don't think you could hide from me? Oh, you're so sweet. I just need some fuzzy ears and I'll furry it up. Hi, baby. Fucking gay. <laughs> furry stuff is gay. 
Yeah, but I like how it looks on me. Yeah, you well, you look good in anything. So I, why, why? I make I make myself look cute, as always. What does that little nerd want to say? High potion. What do you want? What do you want to say, buddy? Huh? Hey, buddy. Huh? Hey, buddy. Huh? You little hey. giblets. Hey, buddy. You little giblets, huh? Huh? How about that? <coughs> how about I falcon strike you all, huh? <laughs> Huh? I'll falcon strike ya. There you go. You go down. What about you guys? Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought. Kick you in the head. <laughs> oh, you're going to get sick? Yeah. I love you. I love you, baby. You're so handsome. You're cute. You're cute. Oh. Ooh. Holy shit, that tickle. That's <laughs> sensitive. Oh, my handsome man, I love you. I love you too. Anybody with bodega or anything in their name, I block. You oh, that? man. Yeah. That pervert isn't allowed on our channels. I'm sorry, it's his call. He's yeah. the one who controls my channel. No, I don't. He's my handler. Well, that, well fine, I am. That's fine. But uh, that scumbag's not allowed on our channel. Okay. Any of our channels, okay? Will do. All right. Lol. Rest well. Hope you have a speedy recovery, Darren. Love from Ireland. Ah, Silas Irish Twitch. She's so sweeties. Adore me. Sorry though, Mr. Cha. Got banned and was concerned. Why did Chug get banned? I am so upset. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, Bob. My husband has the final call on things. I respect his position as a husband. He's only there to protect me. Ooh, final kick. Let's do this. Oh, snap. That's 3,600 that hit with. Oh, man, we're doing that again. Fuck you, man. I don't want to deal with you. Yes. Let's have a, a moment right now. I need to ether up a little. Oh my god, I'm running out of ethers. I need to go shopping somewhere. <sighs> I'll go shopping after this. Oh, I can't go there. Okay. Let's see. Dane, so many weirdos in the weird. Rev has a good sense about him. He does, and I love him so much. Thank you, Dark Giver. He knows how to woo a woman. Mr. Cha is romantic. But he doesn't treat me like a girl. He just talks about his penis and what he wants with it. No, thank you. I'm I'm really not into that type of thing. What are you going to do for me? Uh, 
And not only that, I, I found the man that really does. <laughs> what can I say? I love him. And he's my number one. Oh my. Beat all monsters, go back. Yes, the villagers might have come back. Let's go see. That's that tree. Look at a little tree, it's so cute. Oh, we got to find what age it grows in. There's something special around here with that beautiful tree. And I think that's why it's there. This is... The... Wait. Can I go over here? Yes. An elixir. Women do better anyways. <gasps> Naughty girl. Can I go in there? Is there like a secret? Hi, handsome man. Hi, Huey Lewis and the views. And hi, Ether. All right. Let's... It was just showing us there's a tree there. Yeah, you look amazing, honey. I'm icing. Something in there. Is there, is there people around here? No. Is this a Gavin? Oh my God, it's Gavin. Rev, apparently you have to apologize. For for what? What did I do now? You banned someone. Yeah, they're banned forever. Rev bullied me in high school. He needs to apologize. Bob? Uh, I sincerely say if you're a Bob that I ended up bullying in high school because there have been a couple kids I bullied. I don't remember bullying a Bob. But if that's the truth, I am sorry, Bob. I truly apologize. He you. said he's sorry. Yeah, I am really sorry about that. If that's the real deal. Let me have a smoke break. Yeah, smoke break. Then you have to have some kind of perverted bodega rapist uh, scumbag in your room. I know. That's not going to happen. Are they all the same person? They probably are. Definitely. That's just not going to happen. We don't We don't deal in child diddlers and certainly not uh, rapists and scumbags like, like Tragic. He Sorry. bullied me in daycare. Wow. <laughs> but that's not the same person. I didn't bully... I've never... I never went to daycare. My mother was with me 24-7. Ha-ha! He got you there. But wait a minute. No, that's two different persons. Bob, can you come back to my bed, Bob? They're trolling. It's interesting to see where they're going down in this line of story they want to create. Where are these people I'm a roll. I don't have no idea. New people. I'm right? a roll of blunt for the smoke break. Ah, bejeweled Christian. Mm -hmm. Way to go. Oh wow, that guy is a diddler. Yeah. Uh huh. Tragic is real bad. You have no idea. That's slander, Rev. I'm so sorry. Never in a daycare. Wow, that's nice. What's yeah. Slander? Right. No, what? and it's not slander if it's true. The guy is a pervert. It's on record. The guy's a pervert. <clears throat> she has a very soft side for him. I don't. 
I feel bad for him because he has BPD. Yeah, but is it okay that he's a pervert? No, so he's complete. He is complete delinquent. Thank you. I have a lot of body hair. Uh, 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 now uh, I know they don't know me. Shaddy, by by leg. Baby, if you want to get rid of them because they're being weird. Who is weird, that psycho? Can, Who is like, weird? Because I don't. I have a no weird troll policy. GQ model stalkers. Yeah, like where did you get these psychos in here? I don't know. Can you do? Can you do this? Mm -hmm. Thank you, babe. And no other mods are ever around, so it's like. Yeah, well, they are sometimes. They're just busy lately. Oh. They're, well, it's it's ten thirty at night. Oh, I see. All right, Christian. Sucks I am rev. devoted Christian. Christian sucks, Rev. Jesus. Well, you know, listen. That's weird. I'm under the solid foundation that if you ever cheated or you ever want someone to cheat. They're gonna cheat on you. So no. Why are there so You many... think cheating's okay? I don't. And I'm not gonna cheat on my man. Like why does why does this faggot keep coming in your life? Like you gotta stop giving him signals that you like him. You gotta stop it. I know you got a crush on he, him. Are you like high? But he's a fucking pervert. Like, like stop being so impulsive and go to DBT. No, tell him that you're with me for real. There's no chance that you're going to be with him. Yeah, what he said. Say, okay. So, you big fuck, you're a fucking pervert, okay? Everybody knows it. Like, Shabisky had a lot of stuff on you that was accurate. You're a pervert. And I'm not defending Shabisky because Shabisky's a, a pervert himself, a, a map. Okay? This is it. Like, I'm done with it. I don't want these perverts on your channel. I'm just ignoring them. I'm just going to have my smoke. Well, you're not, you don't ignore them. You go, oh, babe, bodega love. Huh, huh, huh. Like, I know you got a thing for him. Oh, my God. Okay. I, I'm i playing it up. Yeah, you're playing it up. But oh. leave me alone. I knew I was trolling him. It's really gross. He likes it. Ugh, God. How, how did they make accounts so fast? Well, they have a billion stock accounts. I'll get rid of them, baby. Don't worry. I love you. We're making my baby jealous. We can't. We can't yeah, no, do that. No, I'm not jealous. I'm sick and tired of it because I've had dreams about tragic. Okay. And I know this is a thing with you. No, it's not. That is. I don't want him at all. He's a blonde. Shani, I'm a blind. And no, you're the, not. Stop the bullshit. You got dark hair. Okay. You're dark and mysterious, not and I love you. <laughs> not anymore. Uh, well, look. You can try to turn me into a slut all you want, honey, but I'm devoted to you. I know you're devoted to me, but you do have a thing with this guy. And no, like, I don't. And you like flirting with him. Yes, you do. No. Yes, you do. No. Fucking true. So I'm just saying that it's not going to be allowed because the guy is a literal pervert. Yes, sir. All right, thanks. It's not that I'm jealous. What the hell? Oh, you think I'd be jealous of a pervert? I will obey. Do you think I'd be jealous of a pervert? No. Okay. He says he's a self-made millionaire. If he is, that's great. I don't believe that at all. No, he's bullshit player. I, exactly. And he puts his dick everywhere. Mm -hmm. Gross. He might, he might have the looks going for him. Sure, that's cool. But I'm just saying that I'm not cool with him being on our channels. Because he's a pervert. It's the same thing with Von Helton. Like, even if we made up and it was cool, I wouldn't want to be on a show with Von Helton. And I would not want Von Helton in my content because he's a map. Calm down. Calm down, baby. <laughs> it's okay. I got things handled. <laughs> if it upsets you. No, it, it, you, you're acting like I feel threatened by Tragic's uh, 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 prowess or something. I'm not. I'm not threatened by him at all. I'm just saying that no perverts on the channel because it'll destroy your business. Good point. Right. <laughs> Get past them. That's right, Corrine. 
You're gross. Thank you, Corrine. <laughs> yeah, I know everybody thinks tragic. <laughs> I know already that everybody thinks Tragic's hot. You just have to know he's also a pervert. No, I don't think he is, actually. That's bullshit. Like, it's total bullshit. Okay? Does he look like Jesus? No, you like him, though. No, I like Jesus. Yeah, you like Tragic. Just stop. No, I don't. Don't lie about it. I swear to Christ. Yeah, you, you hesitate. Okay? It doesn't matter if you like him or not. I swear to the Lord God, and, and this is a vow. Whatever you vow, you vow in heaven. Whatever you vow, you vow on earth, okay? Thank God. I am not attracted to tragic. I stuttered. I want... You! I know you want me. It is sealed in the name of Jesus Christ. Just because you want the person you're with, like I want the person I'm with, doesn't mean you don't find other people nice looking. I don't find him attractive. Okay, fine, you don't find him attractive. He's not my type. Right. Whatever. Stuttering because she's nervous. Duh. Thank you, baby bear. Uh-huh. He's being aggressive toward me. You're right. No, I'm just sick of the tragic He's shit. He's being like his daddy. No, I'm sick of the tragic shit. Because he keeps coming up. And and it's like you always allow him back in your life again. And it's it, it pisses me off. It does. Because he's a pervert. Not because I know that you got a thing for him. It's not that. It's that I know he's a pervert. And having perverts in your content can ruin your career. Thank you. Yes. He's being a good producer. Mm-hmm. I told you he's my handler. Sure. Fine. Call me your handler. That's cool. I want to protect your career because you need to fucking make money for your kids. <clears throat> there we go. Yep. I feel... I I'm going to try to... Sleep. Feel so unwell. Keep me in your prayers. Night, night. Love you, Shani. Love you, Trish. You sleep well, honey. Try some uh, honey and tea. That'll make you feel better. <laughs> hey, my. my yeah, Shani is right. Tragic is an attractive. Rev is right too. Yeah. <laughs> Rev needs a spanking, mommy, Shani. <laughs> yeah, maybe. The Reverend Hicks is on it, pal. <laughs> no, I, yeah, thanks, my Benda. It's just I'm sick of perverts. You know what I mean? I don't have a pro Like, every time a guy comes on and says my girl's hot and stuff, I think that's great. I love that. Uh, but, 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 but there's history with certain people. And, and we know too much about that one at this point. Okay, I mean, he made a rap about Shani talking about raping her. But somehow she still is okay with him in her life, which is something that I don't understand at all. It's very weird, actually. I'm a psych major. Yeah, no. That that just doesn't... Yeah, there we go. <clears throat> like I said, there's no perverts allowed in the Tragic, chat. I don't fancy you. You are a pervert, man. I swear to God, I don't. Yeah. Well, okay, you gotta make it clear to him then, because that's pretty obvious. Like, he's fishing. <laughs> All right. Like, he's fishing. Listen to me, tragic. Yeah, joke around more with him and make him hard. Uh, wait. Yeah. Maybe he's one of those guys that likes to be beaten up. I mean, we just talked about this guy not too long He's ago. He's probably making a video about it. Yeah, Look that's cool. But, Shani, we just talked about this guy not too long ago off air, and you said he's disgusting. Yeah, get rid of him then. Okay, I did. Oh, good. But I want him to understand what you feel about him. Tragic. She thinks you're a pervert and gross, okay? She's not interested in you. 
So you have to take your, your codependent psychotic ass and find somebody else. Can we play Chrono Trigger? That's not her, because she's taken. Can we play Chrono Trigger? Could, could, could we just expel the pervert once and for all? Oh. Well, he keeps coming back with sock accounts, Dia. Well, that's really nice, Dia. I don't know what to do. That's real nice, Dia. If it wasn't for your trolls, you would have no viewers. That's not true. You lie. Shani's just a flirt. It's naturally she's a flirt. Oh, Thank I you. Yeah. Tell him, Reverend Hicks. Ah, oh, mind bender. I love it when he puts his foot down, actually. Yeah, because I don't normally, because I want you to be free. But there, that, that guy bothers me. He's going to protect his woman. He's got instincts. I trust them. Well, I know he's a pervert, and I, and I find it just insane that, like, he gave him any chances when he made a song about raping you. Because I thought you take rape so seriously. Yes! Yeah. But he got a chance to be in your life. I don't, it's very weird. <sighs> Can I have a hit? Thanks. Hopefully you get happy. Yeah, I, 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 I th I'm going to discuss the shit that's been bothering me because it has been. And he shows up in the room. That's a sign that I got to <gasps> say something. He has to. He just finds me beautiful. But no, dude, if it's bothering him. Is it bothering him? No. If he, if he, if he feels like, no, <clears throat> it's not going to happen. It's, and by the way. No, it's not going to happen because I'm not into you like that. I, I, I feel sometimes psychologically, uh, I feel pity on borderlines because they're traumatized. But at the same time, my husband is protecting me from danger. So I'm going to listen to him. He's right. Well, yeah, I'm done with, with like just being in the background with this subject. Yeah. Because he keeps coming back. And you allow him back. So now I'm going to step in and say no. No more of it. Sorry, tragic. No more of it. No more of me. It's, it's bullshit. Bye. Yeah, thanks, Dark Guyver, because you're cool, man. I know you're into Shanny, too, and that's awesome. I'm not anti-people that are hot for Shanny. I love that. Okay? You should be if you're straight. Absolutely. But, but the, the, the point is, is that this guy, you don't want to know. Like, he's really gross. And I'm just going to let it go. He sends dick pics to everybody. Yeah, he does. Like, immediately, as soon as there's one, like, cute girl that he thinks is around, he's sending dick pics. It's really disgusting. He's whorish. Uh, and, and says he's a Christian, too. It's like, it's really pathetic. You know what I mean? It's pathetic. But thank you for all the support in the chat. I love you guys. Okay? That's right, <laughs> Dork God King. But I'm sick of hearing, oh, I feel threatened by tragic. Oh, he's 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 angry because he's flirting with me. Me, me, me. I'm sick of hearing that. It has nothing to do with any of that. I'm confident in, my, in myself, and I know that there. if I was on the market, there'd be plenty asking, okay? Because I get it a lot. He, he does. Okay, I do. He does. So it's I'm, true. It's not my confidence or any of that shit. I'm saying this guy right there is a pervert, and he's going to destroy your business. That's right. Bye bye Out of the light. Blocked. On every channel, bye. You're gone. Sorry. Yeah, it because Shani deserves protecting, and her career deserves protecting for not just herself, but for her children. Oh, look what Mar Martha Dre said. They want drama, I think. Of course they do, because they got nothing to talk about, because they can't make content themselves because they're losers. Okay, that, that's it. It's not hard to find someone willing nowadays. <laughs> But can you find your one? Can you find the one that just makes you completely twitter pated in every single way? He, when he makes love to me, he shakes my very soul. I'm not giving up that. 
you're a beautiful girl. And, and I very much love you. Happy New Year, Alien Cat Tweets. How are you? God, do you see this? Just, just ignore and block. I just want people to see that, get that, at, I want people to know the same guy is in here, it's at, that ass face is the same fucking guy I'm talking about, okay? I want, this is evidence that he's insane, okay? I want you to know this. It's like, I'm not saying these things for no reason, folks. You want me to mod Dark Dark Iver? Huh? Dark Iver might help you. Like, because this is BS. No, we're not. Listen, all you think about is sex. If you really cared, you'd be my friend. No. But you decided... No, I'm listening. Just let me do this, okay? No friendship. But no. you decided not to be my friend and decided to just keep going to a married woman and soliciting her. Please stop. He did that with Ash, too. Please stop. He's a pervert. That's what I'm thinking. I think he wants you riled up. He needs a video. He's pathetic. Okay, I will personally now block you before he gets angry when I see something. I'm going to pay extra attention. Where the fuck is my phone? There it is. Yeah, I'm You're not going to be... Just ignore the chat right yeah, now. Let me take care of him I'm, until he gets bored. Yeah, I'm done with the chat completely. Yeah. The faggot pieces of shit. Yeah. Come. We don't want my husband, like, sad. You know. I don't want him upset. He doesn't deserve to be upset. Stop upsetting my husband. No, I'm just protecting your, your channel. That's all I'm doing. Because they'll have you flagged out in a second, man. I'm yeah, they will. I'm telling you. <clears throat> Don't worry, I got this stuff. No, I love all the good people in the chat. I, I love all you guys that are that are nice. Uh, but but th there's really some bad people around. <laughs> See? Playing the game some more would be a good idea, I think. Yeah! Let's play the game some more. Stop being distracting. <laughs> I'm gonna finish my cigarette. Damn right. Because I want to. Mm -hmm. Can we all calm down and relax <clears throat> right now? <sighs> we all need, you know, the trolls to stop. Uh, 
Why are they doing all this trolling? They just want people riled up so they can make a video. No, they gave us one one day of, of you know, niceness. Well, you know what? We're going to continue with niceness. And we're not going to let this ruin our day in any way, okay? I get it. I understand. And I'm here for you, baby. 100%. Okay, Scott Stevens, as long as you're nice, you'll be okay. All right. I don't want people hating each other or anything. I love you guys. I want you guys okay and safe and not feeling weirded out. Oh, someone's bored. We're not going to let this, you know, bother us. We're just going to move on. We're going to wait. We're going to relax. We're going to chill. Yeah, we're going to move along. We're going to keep moving forward. We're going we're gonna to love life. We're going to enjoy a beautiful game of Chrono Trigger, and we're not going to let those people bother us anymore. No, they're, and they're all, 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 all sexual perverts. He's right. It's true. And I apologize for... It's really disgusting. ...doing what I did. I apologize for that. That Never again will I do that. <laughs> It's okay, Bejeweled Christian. I got this right now. They're just being weird. You know, this is what they do right now. We'll just wait. They'll get bored and they'll, they'll move along. Their little plans aren't going to work. Love you, Ava. Yeah, just wait. It'll pass. See, Dark Guyver knows how to do it. <laughs> he never steps upon the husband. <laughs> Cause in all honesty, I think also Dark Guyver likes the husband as well. So he's not going to step on him. Am I right, baby? Oh. You know what? I know what to do. Well, thank you, dry ass cookie. I dig Rev. Yeah, he's a cool dude. He's a cool dude and he's knowledgeable and he gets me. He gets me and he helps me when I need help. He's there for me and he cares for me and he loves me. He's my everything. I could never leave him. But I also know he likes to watch. So I do this for him because he likes to watch. It makes him happy. You know what I mean? 
And I want to make my husband happy. Sorry, Rev. Uh. <sighs> yeah, chill out, man. Chill out and enjoy the show. No, I will not. Because I saw what he said to his children. And that was really gross and weird and inappropriate. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, heretic in the hills. We got heretic in the hills in here. Any person that's talking about tragic, will you block? Or if they say baby carrot... For I'm going to be doing this. <clears throat> I'm going currently to my YouTube. And I'm going to my YouTube studio. And in my settings. And then in the community tab. And then I scroll down to block words and I'm going to black tragic. And baby carrot. All right. So, I'm taking your fun away because you keep acting like a dumbass. And I'm just not interested in, in your immaturity. It's, it's like, grow up. Oh, I need to do that. Traj. There's another one. Traj. And I suggest other people do this, too, and block him because he's just going to harass you, too. Traj, we're gonna block Traj. They got what they wanted. And, um, they did, but that's okay. We'll move on. Really <sighs> Go get some air soiled linen. You need it. You smell. <laughs> <laughs> You want me to do a tutorial for my eyeshadow? Yeah, I'll do it just for you. Mind Bender said, tell him, Rev Hicks, dude. We're here for you, pal. Mm -hmm. Ooh. You know what I've, I've always thought was really sexy? What? Is you light me up my cigarette and you pass it to me. Oh, that's nice. That's hot. All right. Check IG message, show rev. All right. One, one moment, folks. We're having a brief intermission. That's what dark, that's what dark Iver said. Okay. <laughs> oh. That's fine. I appreciate that. Thank you. There you go. Yeah, I've had multiple people assure me that that's not the case. I know this, but it just becomes reality. You know, 
when people say it over and over and over and over and over again, it becomes reality. And and yeah, your manhood is a big deal in in the man mind of an individual. That's right. So whatever. Tutorial, yes. I will. I'll do a tutorial on this look. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll, I'll, I'll call the live stream. Hmm. Last night's makeup look. And then... I'll give the link to my Twitch. Because I am turning this live stream off. And putting it on unlisted on YouTube. That's what I'll do. And then everyone can watch it on Twitch. Thank you, Alien Cat Tweets. I saw that. I thought you heard me. We're going to move on from this. We're going to be happy. <laughs> you know, I love this look. This is so pretty. On my cheeks, actually. I used it from my old Anastasia palette. I've used it so much. You can see how much I love Anastasia before I discovered Jeffree Stars. You really can. I think Jeffree Star learned from Anastasia how to make like beautiful glittery effects and then he traveled everywhere to find like pearls and jewels with it because he really wanted to give people a very good makeup look and his lipsticks are amazing because he always does a kiss test with them. You're not Mr. Beast. You and your man showing what marriage is about. That's right. I hope so. That's right. I am. I don't let intimidators come in my uh, chat. really needs to get over this stupid thing man probably missed it my head is a little messed up by covid right now oh i'm so sorry jesus bless your healing oh uh, i hope she gets okay soon Man, I love my girls. Your pizza was perfect? Yes. What did you have on your pizza? By the dork god, Kane, love you. I'm trying to watch you play more Chrono Trigger. I will, I swear to God, after this cigarette. We were just all calming down and just, you know, just getting through this all, you know. We have to. We got to keep moving forward. We can't just let people just bully us off the internet. That's dumb. Or sexually harass us off the internet. Have I played the new Monster Hunter? No, I haven't. How is it? Supreme Girl, you know, already know. I do. Mmm. My son, today, he was like, how about we make some omelets? And I was like, oh my God, that sounds so good. You know what? Tomorrow morning, I'm going to get up early and I'm going to get some eggs and I'm going to get some green peppers and some onions and ham and some of that nice cheddar, sharp, sharp cheddar cheese I love. 
And we're going to make some Denver omelets. Dude. It's going to be delicioso. And I and mushrooms. Uh. Yes. We got to get mushrooms. And I'm going to get my cremini mushrooms. If they have them. Who knows anymore because of COVID. Huh. You love tomato and spinach omelets. Oh my god. Me too. Yeah. So good. I like it when it has e it's pure egg white with a little feta cheese in it. Oh. <sighs> they are testing, 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 testing. Don't worry about baby Carrie. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Don't act immature. We're, I'm a grown woman. I'm a grown woman. You need to speak to me a little maturely. I don't allow children in my room. I'm holding on the best I can, struggling choker. Really? Really? <laughs> no, not really. Not anymore. Jesus. Even G-Man complimented me today and said I've look like I've lost some weight. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just feeling myself, kitties. I'm just feeling myself. Very good. Very good. Let's go back to Chrono Trigger. Yes. Let's set it off the correct way. You're my baby. You're cute. I love you. Phew, I'm worn out. Why don't we head back? There doesn't seem to be anything here but monsters anyway. <coughs> oh my god, Maul. <coughs> Who's making all that hula boo outside? Go on, get yourself eaten by monsters. Serve you right, it will. Oh my god. It's a reptite. Oh, a reptite? They're still alive? <laughs> Talking apes and they... A stand upon two feet. What madness is this? Ape, no good. You say ba Oh, I did that wrong. That was Ayla. Let me do this again. <laughs> Ape, no good. You say bad, Ayla. You bad reptite. <laughs> I love that. <coughs> well, never mind in that. Did you say, not say spy any big strong beasties about? Ella beat monster. You, you what? He's nice. Don't. No, this is Ron. They should not be putting up swords before. He, he sounds like a nice monster. <coughs> That's not nice. They did. They were going to do evil upon him. We're free at last, prisoners in our homes no more, after all these long years of suffering. Come out, everyone. The monsters are gone for good. This isn't some joke, is it? <coughs> is it truly safe? We can come outside. Ah, this makes sense. They think apes are bad, and they didn't handle that very well. <sighs> One minute. Yeah. <laughs> 
You are the most heartfelt thanks. Who would have dreamt that eight men would come to save us? Our days of cowering in cramped caves are finally at an end. You've done us a great kindness. It's not much, but we'd like to offer you this in thanks. After all you've done, it's the least we can give you. Obtained Dragon's Tear. What is a Dragon's Tear? <laughs> I, uh, well, I mean, provided you the time and all, but being as strong as you are, <coughs> I don't suppose you'd be willing to lend an ear when we need some help, would you? We wouldn't ask you to work for free, of course. We're prepared to compensate you for your efforts. And I think it would be worth your while. What do you say? Agree to listen to the Reptite's requests. Yes, man. Excellent. Come and speak to us now again, then. We'll tell you if we ever need any of anything. Are you sure about this? Okay, now we got a bunch of these dudes we can frickin' talk to. Frickin' sweet. Look at this. This is glorious. Look at all. Should I go to the top first? Let's go to the top first. All right. Let's save first in case it crashes. I don't want to start that again. Holy shit balls. Might be combo item having game. Yeah, might be. <clears throat> you seem to be doing well. If only my daughter had that much energy. <laughs> if only I had the energy of G-Man. Oh, my God, that man keeps going. He's amazing. If you happen to come across a rusted blade, bring it to me, will you? I'll refer it for you. A rusted blade? <gasps> oh, my God, I can buy something. Praise Jesus. Oh my god, my high ethers. Oh my god, I can't buy much. There's 6,000. I can't do that. Elixir 20. <gasps> they sell elixirs? I don't have money for that. We got plenty of Athenian water. No. No. I don't want to spend that money for that. Because it's always going to be replaced. A barrier sphere. Shield sphere. Alright. They got he's got some cool stuff, man. Alright. There's something I was hoping you might help me with. A legend in our village tells of a tool known as the golden hammer. And I'd like you to search for it if you are you'd be willing. The tales say it's made from the wood of a golden tree, but I'm afraid I can't tell you very much else. <laughs> Probably that tree that's in the woods. Do you suppose you could spare me the time to, to search? Yes. Agree to search for the golden hammer. Yes. Truly? Oh, I knew I could depend on you. Golden hammer. Looking for the golden hammer, you say? Well, there's a patch of golden sand... In the flower matter down the great southern swamp. Guess that's not what you're looking for, though, is it? A patch of golden sand in the flower matter down below. Okay. Well, that's interesting. <gasps> I can go down. Can I go down here? I can go down here. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, we can go to that meadow. We're going to go in that meadow, but... Is there something on top of here? Can 
like, because there was that one place right here. Oh, wait, that's to go to the other place. Okay. Oh, my God. The other stairs is right there. Okay, let me talk to this guy on the bottom first. Through the narrow passage to the west is a cavern dark as pitch. Beyond that, well, who could know? The place is so dark you cannot see a thing, but I think there's something hidden there. We got to go to a dark cave, man. Is Rev okay? Yes, he's fine. No retreat, no res surrender, pal. This is blood sports, blood, bud. Rev, take no notice of these nobodies. Hope you are all right. He's fine. A legend of the golden hammer. Ah, yes. As I heard it long ago. Sprinkling golden sand about the young sapling will cause it to produce golden wood. Okay, so we sprinkle the sand you get down below onto that tree, bud, up there. The hammer is made from that. Oh, the hammer is made from the tree. I love things that sparkle, don't you? Gemstones and such, they're so beautiful. Okay, they like gemstones. Yes, he's in here. Can I get the little chest in there? If you're tired, feel free to rest in my home. Would you like to rest? Yes. How'd you sleep? All right. Let's do this golden hammer. We're going down here. Hi, Life of Ace. How are you? Oh, yes. Hi, Potion. Lovely. Okay. We have these, like, frog beans. Well, let's see, how, how did, how did, oh, they don't take a smack very well, do they? Or did I just miss by default? Okay, I just missed by default. I'm glowing, though. The creator is my god. I love him so much. Thank you, fitness, Frank. Yay. Oh, there's something down here. There's something down. Oh, over here. What do we got? What do we got? A shelter, huh? And then there's this here. But I want to go over here first. Whoa, there's something there too. Let's go up here first. Let's get this chest. Turbo ether. Okay. Oh, there's something there. Did I find it? <sighs> Just screw off, man. Gonna play Chrono Trigger next. Awesome! I, I influenced you, Dark Giver. SNES? No, this is actually on my Steam app, actually. And, um... I really like it. Secret of Mana? No, this is Chrono Trigger. Yes. All right, let's see. We have inventory, high potion. Let's give it back to our babies. And let's go over here. What is this? So we got to sprinkle this beautiful golden sand. I'm going to keep going through this forest anyway, see what we can find. And we got to put it on that little butter tree that is also glowing. Oh, haha. -ha. 
instincts, baby. Okay, how do I get in this? Aha. We go around here. Athenian water. You always need Athenian water. Where are we got here? It is, isn't it, Dakota? This is a great game, and you know, it's it's pretty cheap actually on Steam. This is my one of my favorite games of all time. And it's so nostalgic just going through it and just seeing all the new things with it. Yes. Oh, we got to break this. Break it. Ah, it sapped me. Come on, buddy. Break that bottle, man. Okay, let's see how magic will do on this. Let's do some ice, too, on this kitty. There we go. Put it on Merle. Ah. Uh. Iceberg toss. Let's do that. We're here for you, Reverend Pal. Cheer up, bud. Thank you. See, your love, baby. I appreciate that. <clears throat> oh, that's the cave. Okay. But I want to go and sprinkle that sand, so I'm... You know what? Fuck it. There's a thing there. Let's go in this cave. Let's let's go look. Let's see what we can find here. Okay, these definitely need magic. All right. There we go. Wonderful. What the fuck? Squidman. Blah, blah. Oh. Oh, is there a secret here? Secret? Oh, how do you get there? How do you get there? Okay. I'm looking for a secret right now, so. Have patience with me, folks. I'm seeing if there's one around here. Okay. See, there's stuff down there. So, you know there's an area where you can get the bottom part of that. You see how they tease you in this game to get all the treasures and stuff? Mm -hmm. It's actually quite brilliant of a gamescape of how they do it. They, like, kind, kind of, like, hide it there. And then you're like, how the hell do you get that? All right. No, you're gonna... Holy light. He just struck me as a holy man, man. Mm. I'll be lapising myself here. Unless I kill them. Oh, yeah, I killed him with Luminaire. Really good. Ayla's level increase. Yay! I'm gonna kiss everyone with Ayla. She likes kissing people, you know? <laughs> She likes kissing and telling it, it seems. She's like, yes, daddy. And then she does it. Okay, let's go out here. No can see. Go back. Yeah, you need the golden hammer to see that. Oh, he's back. Hey, bud. Best game with all the combo items. I know, right? 
and trying all the moves and and seeing how they work. I love this game so much. Aha! A mega elixir, yas. All right, we'll go back. It see how it forces you to go back to finish your mission on putting the hammer and uh, or sprinkling the golden like sand on the thenima jobber. Something, 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 something. I really need some freaking ethers, man. Ah. Uh. All right. Bam. Ah, oh, no. I don't want to do Luminaire. Let's do Frenzy. There you go, buddy. I love this game so much. It's so fun. All right. Well, we'll remember to go back there. We want to Falcon Strike these. Let me do Ice 2 on that. Dude, too. See what happens there. It was actually SNES that Chrono Trigger was originally on. And then they had a copy for the PS1. You know, because I guess Squaresoft was like, you know what? We're going to go to PlayStation and they put out some really good games for the PlayStation. Um, I actually want to do Final Fantasy XIII soon actually um because i haven't played it in a while and i want to do it and finish it have fun with it oh my god chrono you are f fucking horrible right now ah oh, fuck off dude God, I need ethers so bad. I'm gonna just, like, rest after this. I still have the PS4. Is the PS5 as nice as people say? Um, no. Not really. Mindbang does is giving you a big thumbs up. He loves you. Yeah, I appreciate him. Yes. Okay, so that down here. There's the middle. Oh. That's when we first came in, so I want to go on the other side real quick. See what they got there. Unless we have to repeat it, but it's better safe looking than sorry, so we don't have to go back there. Since we're here anyway. Might as well. And you get experience this way going back and forth. You see what I mean? Thank you, Bejeweled Christian! <sighs> yes. Okay. Oh, we're Luminaire. Bam. Is 
they don't get hurt by Luminaire. That's interesting. They just kind of am really defended by... Defense boosted. What a naughty frog you are. All right. Ella, kiss me. Oops. Ella, come here, baby girl. Eight thousand G, see, see. I told you, I told you. I really do know this game. What is this? A guard here. You no pass. Okay, so we can't go in that quite yet. So we literally do have to go back to where we started. Looks like. All right, let's get that golden hammer. Looks like there's something there. Ah, this game is so exciting. I love this game. I really want to finish this game, so I'm determined to do it, and I'm going to do it. This is the best game ever. <sighs> ah. All right. Yes. Do it, baby. Yes! Alright. And then we go... Not there. Over here... To the hammer... I still don't know how to get that. Maybe through those trees back there. Let me look. Oh, what's that say? There used to be an enormous tree growing in this woods, but those monsters felled it. What a waste. It was such a strong and stalwart tree. I know, I saw it. Let's see. It's like the back of that tree back there. Hi, monster. How are you, monsters? All right, you have a good one, alien cat tweets. I love you. Good thing we got Chrono back. Yes. Aw, Alien Cat Tweets is so sweet. Mm -hmm. Take my ice too, buddies. Ow. Let's falcon strike these dudes, men, and do another one of these. There we go. Ow! Stop being mean, guys. There we go. Fixed. <gasps> Mar learned cure too. Mm. Fantastic. Alright, 
It's like right around here. Aha! I figured it out. 20,000 gold for me figuring out that secret. Cheers to me. I am going to have a smoke in celebration. I love you. I love you. You're beautiful. <sighs> I'm showing you all the secrets tonight. <laughs> yes. Oh, these guys. Dudes, just drop it. They're just big bullies, these guys, man. That's what you do with bullies. You just eliminate them and delete them out of your life. But I'm, I, I'm glad I'm paying for your supper tonight, dear. I'm good for that, is, 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 you know, giving people content. Well, it wasn't really me, it was my husband. Well, it was kind of me, too. It's my channel. Mm -hmm. So, enjoy the sausage. Because, you know, Tragic really likes sausage. I'm such a naughty girl. Let's just be honest here. <laughs> I enjoy what I do in life. Ah. Uh, I am content with everything I have right now. I am love. I am joy. I am everything that is everything. I am happy as a clam in life. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Look at him bouncing into me. Like, come on, dude. Aw, <coughs> oh, man, he hit hard. He did a 100. You naughty boy. What a naughty, naughty, ugly thing you are. What are you called? A Ogin Chieftain. Well, <coughs> Ogin Chieftain, you need to stop doing this to people. How about that? You didn't take me off. Ayla, give me boo-boo kisses. <coughs> give him boo-boo kisses for everyone. <laughs> Sprinkle the golden sand around the sapling. Alright. <coughs> All right, now we have to wait for it to grow into a real tree. How long do you suppose that will take? Oh, what if we came back here through the other gate in the Middle Ages? Maybe it'll be have grown already. <laughs> so we got to go to the Middle Ages. All right. Time to go to the Middle Ages, folks. We're on a quest for the Golden Hammer. This is fun as hell this game I love it it gives me joy what can I say and it's so pretty and relaxing and the sounds <coughs> are 
glorious. Oh, let me tell you. Oh, never mind. All right, let's go to the Middle Ages. Bye, guys. I'm checking out of here. I'll see you in a minute. Oh, there's nothing in there. Okay. Okay. Let's save. Since we have the save spot, and we already <coughs> did that, and I don't want to repeat it. So let's do that. Because that's a new thing on the story. Let's see if we can get this golden hammer. Yes, I would like to leave. I gotta get a golden hammer. We will be back. Okay, Middle Ages. Where would this tree be? <coughs> There's that sandstorm thing that we need to go and look for. But where would the tree be? If I was a tree, where would I be? Are they going to make me look at the whole fucking map? Oh my god. That's a forest, isn't it? Ah, oh, we can go here in the blue light. That's where you go. What is this? Ooh, it's a mystery. Let's go down here and check what this place is. Can I go in this? It doesn't look like <coughs> it. What is over here, though? That's curious. Ozzy's Fort. Oh, you can go in Ozzy's Fort there. Okay, I think we've already gone there, so we don't have to. What the fuck? I can't get through here. Oh, Lord. All right. Let's go around. Ah. Uh, why can't I go any further? See? They got me stuck. They got me stuck. Are you kidding me? Wait. How the f... <coughs> Can someone please tell me how this happens? Alright, we're gonna start this game over real quick. Thank God I saved. Yeah. See? I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> We're going to have a little break real quick. I'll put some on beautiful music for you. That'll be fun. And, and, and we're just setting boundaries. Yeah, because I want you to succeed. Absolutely. I really do. Badly. This is some um, natter music. Oh yeah, this is definitely natter music. <laughs> He'd be doing his stuff to this, definitely. The, the, this, yeah, he does. And then he pulls up his shirt, looks at my ass, baby. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty good. Yeah.
I love how they do that in music like that. EDM, yeah. Yeah, it's really cool sounding. Mm -hmm. It's marvelous, darlings. I like dubstep shit too. Cool. Absolutely. It's called Cartoon by the Howlin, featuring Isana. That is what it's called. Oh, man. Babies. You want to get on frame now? You, uh, what? Well, I mean, I just... Be sit. the reverent. We'll turn on the J-cam. If you want it on, you can have it on. Yeah, we have it's the reverend Hicks here right now. I am actually under the weather. That's the truth. Like, definitely. He really is. You can see in the color, guys. My eye, Like, G-Man said, you need to get out in the sun or something. I'm like, no, nah, I'm sick, dude. <laughs> I'm sick. Yeah, I, I told you I fucking... was sick. So, yeah. and I still have the sniffles from it. I'm white as a sheet. But I, I think there is definitely diseases going around. I just think it's better to deal with this with the, your immune system. In my opinion, you know. I agree. Just personally. There he is. There's that pisser. <laughs> I love you, dude. Thank you for the encouragement. You should do a, a show with him once a week. A show is a it's a big dedication. That's that's what it is. Mm. It, and it is. I do. I really want to be involved in a show. I don't know <laughs> yet. But if I did something with anybody, I would definitely consider him one of the first. Because he's funny. Yeah, I've been waiting. Well, you're good. You're talented enough to do something alone, mind Benda. You really are. You're very talented. So, you do something. And if I, if the reverend individual goes, well, I can do this now because my mind is good enough or whatever, we'll do it, you know? Exactly. But you're very talented. So Yes. Back to Chrono Trigger. We could try a monthly one first. Start slow. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. But trolling, if if we find mm. any trolling involved, okay? <sighs> I need a solid number two, smooth and regular. Don't we all? I hear you. Yeah, it's the same way with my show. When I lost my host, it was like, yeah, I, I got to find somebody else. And then I did it with Steve Denoon for like three years or two years, whatever. You know, I, I want to do broadcast. I do. Yeah. But it's like this stuff has really messed with my mind bad. So I have to get in a better place first, bro. Yeah. When he does... We're going to have fun. Yeah. I promise. Good. Yeah. We're going to have fun. Sure. You know, no problem on my part. You know? No, it's cool. I love you. I love you, baby. You can turn, you can, um, turn off my cam if you want to. Just have your beautiful face on. Yes, baby. You're gorgeous and amazing. Thank you. I love you. I love you. You keep me functioning. Oh, babe. You're my girl. Isn't he sweet? You are. You're my baby. All right. We're not going to park there in the Middle Ages this time. Yes, I would like to leave. I don't do mean-spirited, pal. <laughs> That's good, because we don't need mean-spirited anymore. Not anymore, no. No. Nothing. We're not mean people. I know I can be mean. But I'm not a mean person. Not at all. No. Baby I'm a sweet person. Yep. You only, you just, you, you used to react when you were attacked, and you don't even do that now. Uh, hey. Did I just do that? Oh. 
Wait, we are in the Middle Ages, aren't we? We are! Why are you scared? Talking apes! Hairless talking apes! Run for your lives! <laughs> Wait! Are you truly talking apes? You're a rude one, aren't you? Oh wait, that's Marl. Sorry. You're a rude one, aren't you? No, we're not apes. We're humans. That's right. That's racist. <laughs> Goodness. I see. So the legend was true after all. Isn't that interesting that the reptiles are after yeah. the humans? Doesn't that sound a little interesting in like certain conspiracy theories out there i'm just i'm just saying or the doctor who episodes where the uh reptile beings i forgot what they're called called if someone can tell me in the comments that would be wonderful but they live underground it's a great episode yeah you know Great episode. That's really cool. And episodes. And then in also Doctor Who, they have that alien girl, lesbian couple with a human. Yeah. She's not an alien girl. She's a reptile. Like, with a human. Because apparently the humans all killed the reptilian people. And the reptilian people went underground mm. because of it. And there, there was going to be a time when they introduce themselves when we're ready. Oh, interesting. I see. I so. The legend was true after all. What do you mean, Elder? It is a most ancient legend. Long ago, hordes of vicious monsters preyed upon our village, threatening to destroy our people entirely. But okay. just when hope was lost, the most unusual of heroes appeared. Talking apes? None other. And in no time at all, they drove the monsters away and saved the village. So these apes are the heroes from the legend? I believe they may well be. Pardon me for being so forward, but might we contract your assistance? Contract? I would propose a contract by which we would reward you for your aid on certain tasks and errands which we cannot do ourselves. If you're the strength you seem to have, I think you'd find it profitable proposition. What do you think? Agree to help the reptites. Oh my goodness. Then we are agreed, and if it's not too sudden... I have a task for you already, but I wanted to get the golden hammer. The monsters in the wood beyond have been growing in a number as of late. Would you vanquish them for us, brave heroes? What mean vanquish? Mean eat? No, it means beat them. Take them on. All right, what does all these guys say? I noticed the golden tree in the Millennia Wood was gone when I went exploring not long ago. Cut down by Ogins, no doubt. They always fell, fell in trees to craft those hammers of theirs. <laughs> they took my tree that I went through time for to get a hammer and it was stolen by bastards. Horrible. I gotta make sure. Maybe they're back there. If you ever happen to find some lumacite, would you bring it to me? I'll craft you some fine armor from it. I've been a smith for a great many years. Lumacite. Well, let's see if I remember that crap. Lumacite, huh? I've been thinking of talk in, taking a walk in the mountains. You should too. Oh! 
Take a walk in the mountains. Will do, will do. Thank you for letting me know about the mountains. All right, we got this up here. We got to look up there. We got to go up there. But let's talk to these guys. Let's see. I want to build something that will last for future generations to use. Like a ladder. Incredible, aren't they, ladders? I always wonder who built them and when. Ladders. Okay, so we got to find a ladder for this dude. All right. That neighbor of mine loves to build things almost as much as he loves to tell me about it. Hasn't anyone else to bother all day? God, he's, he's, he's mouthy. It's been my lifelong dream to build a great bridge to span the mountains. I'll do it. Just you watch. All right, cool. We're going to go back to the tree. What? Hey, why don't you stay for the night? Yeah, I'll stay for the night. Good. I am healed. Did you sleep well? Yes, I did. You guys have been saying the same thing for centuries. Oh my god, there's another one of them. That's fun. Alright. Hey, buddies. It's been a while. How you doing, little guys? Ow. How dare you hit me. I'm just a girl. All right. So, we still haven't gotten the hammer. It's 12 a.m. Oh, Lord. It's quite a time that we're having here. All right. Yes. A shelter. Yes. I'm sick of playing with these people, man. They're just being mean to me, man. They're just trolls. Can't take me on, man. Bam. Bam. Ow! Yes. Bam. Yosh. Come on, man. Get it going. All right. If they don't have the golden ladder here, I know I'm going through this. I'm going to save and we'll start up tomorrow. In trying to beat Chrono Trigger because I am determined for this. I must have it done. Yes. It is done. Oh, there's another 25G there. That is so sweet. Ah. Oh.
Go away. I hate these things. Ow! They're sucking my girl dry, man. Ayla, kiss my girl, man. Twin charm. Uh. Final kick. Iceberg toss. Um. Thunder chomp? Yeah, let's thunder chomp that bitch. And then we'll ice to him. Thunder chomp away. Aw, oh, man. That didn't even work. Well, we're not doing thunder chomp again. We, f we survived the thunder chomp experience. Yay. Uh, there we go. Okay, nothing there still. Just making sure we gotta try to figure out how to get in here. How to do it? Aha! Turbo Ether. Lovely. All right. Ah, uh, you guys are back. Okay, I don't, like, like you people, so... Back off. There we go. Ah, it's on the top. No? No shiny tree. Gr Ella, grow. Why no here? Ah, there you are. Look, gold hammer. Oh, it's a gold hammer. Wait. There was a chest there, though. Marl, he, sh he should still be around here. Let's go find him. Okay, but first, let's... Oh, it didn't take me away from there. Oh, thank God. Let's get this. A mega elixir. Yes! He around here. Oh, look at that. Aha. A dragon head. Okay, that is an equipment... Oh, look at that. Yes. It gives you strength. That's awesome. All right, we're going to find him. Where do you think he went? Hmm. Can we go there still? Nope. Ah, there you are. Oh, Lord. Okay, Falcon Strike. Just got off Animal Crossing with husband, teaching him how to play, laugh out loud. He got bit by a tarantula first time seeing one of the game. It was silly. Oh, that's hilarious. Tomorrow morning at around 8, I shall be playing Animal Crossing for a couple hours. So, stay tuned for that. I'm sorry, sir, but we don't do any... Let me pause real quick. We don't do self-promotion on my channel. So, I apologize for that. Have a wonderful day and, and, and good luck on your channel, sir. Ice to that. Oh my god, she died. Okay, we need a Thinian water. And we need a high potion. No, wrong person. For the high potion. 
We need a high potion stat. All right, let's do that. He's down already, so it's good. Triple kick him. Ah, oh, my girl. Let's boulder toss his ass. I just want to just slam him on the ground. There, that was 72. 172, I mean. Ah, oh, he got me again. Alright. I'm gonna falcon strike you. I don't care. You're gone. Oh my god, he only gets 200 for that. Uh... Let's thunder chomp his ass. Yes. Okay. Iceberg toss him. Let's see if that works. That's 863. It, it kind of worked. What ice combo do I have with... Thunder Chop. It's okay, Chevy. Don't worry about it. Karma always repays itself. I'm not worried one bit. Ah. Oh. Let's Luminaire him. See what happens. Oh, Luminaire was good. Oh. Oh, I got him. I love it. 10,000 gold. Ah. Oh, that is yummy. Listening while I get to drive to work, popping in to say hi. Hi, Christina, beautiful. Everyone should subscribe to Christina Blackfeather. She makes incredible art, by the way. I got my golden hammer. Yes. So since I got the golden hammer, I can help these people. But I'm actually taking off for the night. I'll be back tomorrow at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Or 9 a.m., sorry. 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Oh, yes, but we have a little bit more, but remember, 9 a.m., we're going to play some Animal Crossing. That sounds like a threat. I'll be making sure and to give that to G-Man, that message, so he can give it to his lawyer. So I'm going to text him real quick with that. 
and um, convey the message that you wanted to give. There we go. So let's go back to Chrono Trigger, whatever we have now. We got rid of all the monsters. You slew all of them, heroes indeed. Please take this as your reward. Ooh, I got a mega elixir. I'm sure we'll have other tasks to request of you in the days to come. I hope we can continue on your aid. That was sweet. All right, we're gonna go down tomorrow and play this at nighttime. So don't forget 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. We're going to be playing some Animal Crossing. So anyway, peace and Maranatha, my lovelies. You have a wonderful night. Thank you for joining me. Thumbs up. It helps me a lot. And um, if you watched all the way to the end of this stream, 